Yo, yo, yo. Welcome back to One Cent Sports Cards YouTube channel. Going to do some legit sound testing today because. Oh, I get a pen. Oh, Firestone. Firestone commercial. I'm running a new computer tonight. So let me see if this thing's act. I'm hoping all of my settings are correct. I sound a little odd. The mic sounds a little different, but I think we're okay. Um, I can't get my second screen to work. It is not a typical screen. It is like a USB, plug it into a laptop. It attaches to a laptop. It's a cool thing, but the driver is not working. So we're going one screen. We're going old school tonight. So we'll see how that works. Uh, but we have a rather large night of breaking cards. So we are going to be busy tonight. Um, not as busy as the MLB schedule, um, but maybe as busy as the San Francisco Giants bats. They put up a 19 spot on the Reds today, improved their record to 28 and 16. No one saw that coming. And don't look now, but the AL, the reigning AL champs, the Tampa Bay Rays, or 26 and 19, won a game today 10 to 1. So we will see how the stream goes tonight. I believe it's going to go fine, but I am running a new computer. So if we run into issues, um, it's a new computer, it's technology. What do you want to do? I've had the computer for literally two days. Uh, I think it was a couple of weeks ago. I was getting coffee and holding my computer in one hand and coffee in the other walking out of my kitchen where there is a door to my kitchen, the, the computer hit the doorknob, knocked out of my hand out of a pure reflex. I tried to kick the computer back up into my hand. That didn't help matters. It hit the hardwoods. The computer still worked, but the screen was all smashed up. There's like glass shards everywhere from the screen. So it was time for a new one. And so now we will see how this one runs. We have... A full house tonight and a full, full slate of cards to rip. Welcome, Paco, Junk Wax Gods. How you doing? Jeremy Little, how are you? Um, in here for moral support. Love that. Um, as in music, there are no spots open, but if you want to get in the next break, look at the pinned message in the live chat. And uh, Philip, thank you for the welcome from Houston. Houston, I believe, took over first place today in the AL West, beating the A's. So Houston went from a bunch of people thinking they weren't going to be that good when they started the season, and now they are back in first place. Um, it just goes to show that a lot of people overreact in the first couple weeks of the season. Uh, the Yankees are back on track. All these teams that kind of stumbled out of the blocks are now rising to the top. So it'll be interesting to see how that plays out through summer. Bethany, how are you tonight? Hope you're doing well. Barry, thank you for joining us. Always good to have you, bud. And uh, let's see. So here's what we got tonight. Basically, I got a few personals we're going to rip real fast. One for Stack Pack Matt, one for John S., one for Jay Chez. Then we got break one and break two. Same exact breaks. Uh, break, and they both have uh, one box of Bowman 2021 hobby box and then a hobby box of tops baseball series one and so we are doing a little bit of a tops versus bowman series one i believe was out of all of the flagship sets from tops last year uh by far the best one of them so top series one series two an update uh series one was absolutely loaded and then of course bowman baseball 2021 we've all seen plenty of that ripped by now um, and we know what's in that. So what I like about breaks that go over two years, uh, lots of good teams in this one and lots of different good teams in this one. So everyone should have should wind up getting some pretty decent teams out of this. Um, I know Bethany does not want the Indians. So if Bethany gets the Indians, we have to spare her. And someone's got to trade for the Indians with her. <laughs> um, so because the Indians are haunting her dreams at this point. So, Captain John is in the house. Chris Day, how you doing, bud? It come up an egg. How are you? Thank you for joining in. Uh, by the way, 
it come with a, a, an egg. If you ever want to be in like a really good auction with a guy that is much better at live streaming than me, you need to go there. That is exactly where you need to go. Very fun stream. He is a fantastic streamer, has fantastic cards, better cards than I'll ever have in an auction. Um, he has like warehouses full of cards. So check that out. Um, I don't know. Is it warehouses or is it just rooms? Um, I, I think it's warehouses. Pallets. Pallets and pallets of cards. It's fantastic. So here's what we're going to do first. We're going to get into the personals. Probably start with John. Well, let's see. A stack pack, Matt. Or JHS. Have I seen any of them yet? Shalani, what's going on, bud? Um, old Styles in the house. Good to see you. Marching towards the weekend. Had a big day. You guys are going to have to bear with me a little bit today. I have um, my, my big home remodel is still happening. And they tore out the deck today. And it was, it was a lot to handle with kids uh, being at home from school. And there was the, their tutor that I have for them, those people working in the backyard, plus my job. It has been a busy day. So we will see if I make it through the night and don't just slump over onto my desk uh, before the night's over. So we are going to go a little bit quick because there's a lot of cards in here. But of course, as always, we will try and see as many cards as we can and um, sleeve up all of our good ones and stuff. So I'm not that kind. I do love the frying egg pan, though. Um, okay, so why don't we do this? We're going to get in. Um, Got to give my kid some love to my kid sealing both wins at the ship. Yes, Captain George. So what did they win? Did they win, did they win state? Um, because if they won state, that is fantastic. But I know they had their backs against the wall, and they had to go win out, and they did. So that is awesome. Um, and as a dad who coaches... U10 league, um, I can only imagine how much pressure you feel as a dad when they're pitching at a much higher level than that. Um, even at U10, I'm like, oh, we got to win the game. Um, and I try not to be that dad, but sometimes I fall into that trap. But for the most part, I try and make sure the kids have fun. Uh, but I am, I am getting a little impatient with kids that cannot keep their back foot down when they swing. Uh, we've been preaching that for too long now, but um, so so um, but they'll, they'll get it one day. They will get it. So, Jeremy, thanks for becoming a top prospect for the channel. That is fantastic. We uh, he officially gets the rookie card logo. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get right into it. Um, I have not seen John yet. I was hoping someone would show up, but we cannot slow down tonight. We're gonna go fast. So the first thing we have is uh, the just a hanger box for John S. It is 2021 Series 1. So we'll rip this real quick and see what we can get out of there. John, I hope you're in. KC Nation, what's going on? Um, he wants his three spots back. KC Nation was supposed to be flying out today back to KC for a graduation. Uh, but unfortunately, I tell you, I need a new knife. I need to put a new blade in. Um, and his flight, his flight got delayed. He forgot, well, he didn't forget. He thought the date of the stream was different. So he said, Hey, I got to back out. Um, cause I'm not going to be around for the stream. Then I sold the spots and now I don't have the spots for you, KC. What can I say? There's only so much I can do for you, bud. All right. So here we go. John S. Thanks for getting a little personal. We'll see what we can get for you out of a little 2021 top series one. And then we will start breaking a little bit of bowman then we'll get into both the breaks like i said we're gonna go a little bit faster tonight um with the cards we're i think we've got a little over a thousand of them to run through so we will see what we get um jd martinez is going to be our first card of the night hex game just became a pa patreon how you doing bud um Hex game is john s by the way all right so here we go ahmed rosario hector neris Harrison Bader, D. Strange Gordon, Glaber Torres, and Josh Donaldson, Avasil Garcia, Franco, Tony Gonslin, Rockies, Brett Godna, uh, we'll go like this with these, Austin Meadows, Yuli, Ian Kennedy, Bieber, 
Hands up, mask up. Such a 2020 card in 2021. Manny Machado. And there's Juan Soto. We'll give him a little sleeve for the Soats. Post-game hand wash. And we got some rookies here. Cody U Hewer, uh, Alex Gordon, Wade Davis, Travis Dierno, U Darvish, Ryan Yarborough, Arizona Diamondbacks, the Pirates, and a Ryan Brassier, and I believe I'm mistaking. Uh, thought that may have been a short print. Um, all right, here we go. Tops, Chrome, Raphael, Devers. Nice one here. Devers having another... Devers is one of those players that does not get enough hobby love. Uh, all he does is play consistently good baseball. Um, he's slowly putting, putting together a career that here in a couple years could very much, come on, could very much have him on track for the Hall of Fame. But so far, not a ton of hobby love. This is a nice one here, the Paul Goldschmidt, and that is a rainbow foil. So a little Goldie. Goldie could pick it up this season for sure. But Arenado is having a fine season, so... The Cardinals kind of knew that. And I think Goldie will be right where he needs to be by the end of the season. We've got Josh Bell, 52 redo. We've got a Nolan Arenado, 52 redo. Javier Baez. And how about a Ronald Acuna Jr. Ronald Acuna. All he does is hit home runs and get on base and steal base and basically be the best player in baseball. Um, especially now that Mike Trout is injured. But there's a nice 52 redo for Ronald Acuna. We've got Jack Flaherty. And then we have the cards that go for way too much money next. Um, I have no idea why these cards are holding the value they are. But we'll take it. We've got David Ortiz through the years. It's a little five-star Red Sox patch right there. So nice one. And as we continue on, we've got Roberto Osuna. Blake Trainer rookie card. Put that over here. Walk off apart. Josh Bell, Sean Doolittle, Tampa Bay Rays, dab on him. There's another Soto League leader. So it come if an egg is having an auction a week from tonight. So be sure to check that out. Brady Singer, Alex Verdugo, uh, Padaris rookie card, and Pache rookie card. Pache, not so good this year at the major league level. So... Getting a little bit more training, which is to be expected. He's not, a, in all honesty, he is not the greatest. He's, uh, he's a great defensive player. Uh, offensively, could still use some improvement. Miggy, Luco, Gio Gonzalez, Contreras, Moreland. And there's Mike Trout. Mike Trout gets a sleeve on this channel, even if his calf is getting a sleeve at the same time. All right, Shane Beaver. And we've got Matt Boyd, Luke Voigt back off the IL recently. Still needs to pick it up. He did get his first home run of the season the other day. Uh, we've got Junis, Candelario, Ryan Castellani, rookie, Nick Heath rookie, Tristan McKenzie rookie, Shohei Otani, Shane Beaver, Fultanowitz, and we have Ian Happ and Joey Votto for that hanger. So we get a Pache rookie couple uh nice ronald acuna jr 52 but paul goldschmidt Raphael devers so thank you very much john for that one and our next personal let me get caught up on chat here um let's see medium rare is in the house medium rare let's see so have we seen jhs was the second Josh Bell, uh, was that the second different Josh Bell that came out? I don't, don't believe so. I'll go back and look. Um, all right, so our, our next one, this one's going to be for Jaychez, or if Stack Pack Matt is here. Iris Collins, how's it going, bud? Iris is in the break tonight. All right, so here we go. Jaychez getting this one, and this is a Bowman Blaster 2021, so we'll see what we can get out of this. And remember, right after just a couple personals, we're going to run through real quick, um, and then we will get into break number one while we wait for a 
some stragglers to stroll in for the break. Make sure we got most everyone here. So that way we got a nice active hot stove running. Um, so what do we get out of here? Six packs for Bowman. We're looking for the green parallels. And we're looking for autos, obviously. Um, and really, just first Bowman and first Bowman chromes. So this one, J Chez 12. Good luck. And away we go. We're going to start. I'll put these up here. I'm going to start with Tatis. Comes back off the IL. All he did yesterday, first game back off the IL, was go four for four. You know, all in a day's work. Anthony Rendon, Mountcastle rookie card, Javier rookie card, Braylon Marquez rookie card, Shohei Otani, and a nice Nate Pearson, ninth overall. This is a Bowman Scouts top 100. And we have a Nick York chrome, O'Neill Cruz chrome, Bryce Jarvis, Adinso Reyes, first Bowman, and a Kristen Robinson. Next pack. Um, break number two. Oh, wait. Yeah, the 52. Correct. That's kind of what I was thinking, too. Um, Charlie Blackman, Anderson, Bryce Harper, Yadier Molina, Frankie Lindor, J.D. Martinez, and a Jake Cronenworth. Nice one here. Rookie of the Year favorites. Uh, Cronenworth having another solid season in San Diego. Cronenworth is going to be... You know, is it going to be a Hall of Famer one day? Not sure, but I will say one thing. A solid everyday player, I believe, for years to come. He's going to be, one, at the very least, one of these days, he'll be in Topps Archives as a fan favorite auto. Oswaldo Peraza, Daniel Espino, those are our two chromes. C.J. Abrams, Libertore, and Jake Vogel. All right, next pack, Austin Hayes, Evan White rookie, Leori Tavares, Jazz Chisholm rookie, nice one there. The Marlins playing okay baseball. Uh, let's see, we got Casey Mize, Davey Garcia, and look at this one, nice one here for the Rays, Wander, Franco, Brent, Honeywell, and Vidal Brujan. Nice little Wander action on the talent pipeline card for Jay Chez. Do I got any more blasters for sale? Well, I do, but they would have to wait until the end of the night. Um, we got a lot of cards to break. Um, I will have more. I also have the Val Packs with the camo cards, but I have not listed those yet. Garrett Mitchell, nice one here. And Ishmael, whoa, 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 whoa. Ishmael Mania. That's a first Bowman Chrome for the Padres. Nice one there. We've got... Pete Crow Armstrong, Tyler Freeman, and there he is, Mr. Maximo Acosta. I tell you, I cannot wait to hear his name announced at a baseball game. I mean, you could have so much Maximo Acosta. You could just hear it now. It's awesome. Very nice card there for the Rangers. Jay Chez pulls a Maximo first Bowman paper. See if we can get him a chrome while we're at it. Got half half the blaster to go. All right, here we go. Another nice one. Jake Cronenworth. So that's our second crony in the box. That's a paper rookie. Luis Campusano, Ronald Acuna Jr., Shane Bieber, Yelly, Sean Murphy, Lewis, and Austin Hendrick. Nice one there for the Reds. It's not a first, but Austin Hendrick was their first-round pick in 2020 for the Reds. Braden Shoemake. Bryson Stott, Chatham, and Jordan Belazovic. Let's see some color. I agree. I'll take some colors. A little little green refractor. Well, I'm sure we're going to see some color tonight. All right, here we go. Scherzer, Bryant, Santander, Bobby Dahlbeck, rookie, Christian Pache, rookie, and the... Kybert Ruiz rookie as well. And here's a nice one. The top 100 Adley Rutschman ranked number four overall. So there's the Adley. Nice one for Jay Chez. And we've got Nolan Jones, 
And another first Bowman Chrome, this one of Nick Ma uh, Matten, already in the bigs. First Bowman will take it for the Phillies. And a Robert Hassel paper, Matthew Thompson, and D.L. Hall. All right, last pack for Jay Chez. It's been a decent little blaster here. A few first Bowman Chromes, that's always nice. And the Adley, not to mention Wander was in here. All right, here we go. Luis Patino, Mr. Mike Trout. So bummed. The good news is that opens the door for Otani to win the MVP. Right now, is Otani the MVP? I believe he is. Leading the league in home runs, has a fantastic batting average. Uh, all right, here we go. Luis Castillo, Cody Bellinger, has a sub-3 ERA. Josh Donaldson, Aaron Nola. And we're going to have a 91 throwback. And that one is going to be for Nate Pearson. Nice Nate Pearson rookie card. Love the 91 throwback chrome refractors. Just beautiful cards. Um, going to be tough to grade because a lot of them are not centered perfectly. But nonetheless, just beautiful cards. Nice one here. Great pitching prospect, uh, Nate Pearson. And we have Gunnar Henderson. And we are going to get some color in here. So we'll bring that to the back. We've got Montero, nice Andrew Vaughn there, Nick York, and the Gunnar Henderson will work as our reveal for Jason Rosario. And this one is a nice even number, numbered 100 out of 199. So we get the Magenta Parallel in the last pack for Jay Chez of Jason Rosario. See if I can get this on here. Here we go. There we go. Numbered 100 out of 199. Nice looking card there. Congrats on that one, Jay Chez. Thanks for getting a personal. And so we get a magenta, the Nate Pearson, the Adley Rutschman, the Mayton. Uh, we also get the Maximo Acosta paper, Wander Franco, Jake Cronenworth rookie, plus a lot of other rookies. We'll get most of those sleeved up for you a little later. Jay Chez, and now we move to Mr. Stack Pack Matt while he's barbecuing. Stack Pat, it is your up for your personal, right now. So let's do it. Stack Pack, good luck. Thanks for getting a personal. Don't let the personal burn the burgers. That that would be criminal. And then you lose like, you lose just a little bit of your man card when you burn the burgers. So don't let this break. Burn the burgers. So Jeremy throws up the fire emoji. And stack pack. Let's get to it. Here we go. And my trash is already out of control. Because I'm not throwing it right into the trash. One of these days for Father's Day. Father's Day, I've told the kids. Find a way for my trash to work. Here we go. Nice one here. Starting off good for Stack Pack. Here we go. Alec Boom. Rookie card. And right after this, we are going to get right into break. One of two this evening. Here we go. Nolan Arenado. Oh, Juan Soto. Burn them all you want. Pull some fire. <laughs> Aaron Judge, Mike Yastrzemski, Bo Bichette, Trevor Bauer. And there's a nice one. How about Bobby Witt Jr.? Just signed him in my keeper league. Someone dropped him because of injuries. I've got a ton of injuries. I said, I don't care. It is a keeper league. Bobby Witt. I've got, one, I've got Bobby Witt sitting on the bench. I've got Wander Franco sitting on the bench. They're going to sit there all season. I'm not going to win this year. But I also have Vladimir Guerrero Jr., Fernando Tatis Jr. I'm going to be a friggin' juggernaut. Uh, here's another nice one. The rage of last week, Jared Kelnick. Chrome. Another nice one for Stack Pack. 
Matt, congrats on those two. Couple nice chromes coming out of the first pack. We've got Marco Luciano, Simeon Woods Richardson, and Ronnie Marusio. Let's see if we can get an auto out of one of these blasters. That'd be awesome. Here we go. Jorge Soler. Jesus Sanchez, that's a rookie. Kirilov, he's going to be coming off the IL maybe by the weekend. Uh, Jose Garcia, Andreas Jimenez, he's been sent down. There's a nice one. Dylan Carlson, still having a decent season out there in the gateway to the West. St. Louis, Dylan Carlson, rookie card. We've got Miggy Cabrera. Matt Manning Chrome, Hunter Green Chrome. Hunter Green throws like a gazillion miles an hour. Gabriel Arias. There's another Bobby Witt. Two Bobby Witts coming out of two packs. So two Bobby Witts for stack pack. Flip them burgers. Don't let them burn. All right, here we go. Matt Manning and our next pack. Junk Wax God says, let's go. Fire time. Two Bobby Witts, that's fire enough. Let's see if we can make it a little bit hotter. Max Kepler, Glaber Torres, Blake Snell, you Darvish, Tariq Skubal, rookie, Clark Schmidt, rookie, and Luis Patino. That's a Bowman Scouts top 100. Love these cards. Love it when they're actually cut right as well. Um, we've got Austin Wells, Mackenzie Gore, a couple nice chromes there, O'Neill Cruz, Hunter Green, and another Austin Wells. Austin Wells is an interesting player. He was drafted twice by the Yankees, uh, one in 2020, one in 2018. Uh, he went back to school in 2018. So they thought so highly of him, they said, let's sign the guy twice. Tristan McKenzie, they love themselves power-hitting catchers, that's for sure. That's a rookie. We've got Ian Anderson having another good season. Started a couple starts slow, but now kind of back on track. Uh, I believe he pitches tomorrow. And we've got Nick Madrigal on the scorching hot Chicago White Sox, even if they do have a crazy manager. Uh, Garrett Crochet, Jose Altuve, Pete Alonzo, and a 91, little bit of a miscut here, Mackenzie Gore. We've got Heliot Ramos as a chrome, a nice Nick Gonzalez chrome. Nick Gonzalez going to be one of those guys you want to hang on to. Uh, we've also got a Zach Veen paper, Ramos, and another Nick Gonzalez. So we're doubling up on cards in this box. All right, two more packs to go. Carlson batting 300. Is he really up to 300? I thought he was a little lower than that, but the stats are still the stats still go way up and down this early in the season. You can raise your batting average a good 20, 30 points with a good week. Um, Luis Garcia, Sixto Sanchez, Jordan Alvarez, he's having a great season, Jacob deGrom, Clevenger, Matt Chapman, Emerson Hancock, nice one there, Isaiah Green, Ishmael Mania, that's a first, Carson Tucker, and another Emerson Hancock. And our last pack for Stack Pack Matt, gonna be, let's get that off here, um, see what we can get. Baez, Merrifield, Joe Adele. And of course, after the Joe Adele, you're going to get Cabrian Hayes. It's the pack sequencing in your favor. Sometimes it's not in your favor. Other times it is. So we get Cabrian Hayes and Joe Adele back-to-backs. We'll take it. So there's the Hayes, and we have Spencer Howard, Cattell Marte, Riley Green, Futurist. Riley Green, another one of those really highly touted prospects for the Tigers. And we have another Chrome. This one's going to be Christopher Morell. That is a first Bowman for the Cubbies. Um, you know, I have not looked at the back. Uh, 2015 free agent. So there is another first Bowman Chrome. We've got Grayson Rodriguez, and we're going to have some color in the back as well. There's Asa Lacey, Cade Cavalli, and our color will be a Geraldo 
Perdomo, Geraldo Perdomo, and this is a 249 out of 250 paper, purple, purple, paper, parallel. Nice one there for the Diamondbacks. And that is how, and it's funny because on my screen, it looks like it's almost blue. It's, it's crazy how this thing does not, I promise you it's way purple. Uh, Geraldo Perdomo, 249 out of 250. And that is going to do it for Stack Pack Matt. Pulls himself enough, a couple of nice rookies, the Cabrian Hayes, the Purple Perdomo, um, the Joe Adele, a couple Bobby Witts, a Dylan Carlson rookie, Kalanick Chrome, Alec Bohm rookie. So a little bit more of a rookie flair there versus a first Bowman, but out of the ones we got, some of the bigger rookies from 2021. So we'll take it. Stack Pack Matt, again, thank you for getting a personal. And now... It's break time. So this is going to be break one. This is going to be break two. We're going to pull break two off the table because we're going to need the room. Sorry, late to the party. What three teams did I get? Clark Sports Cards. Uh, Clark Sports Cards. You are not late to the party. We were doing some personals. So we're just now getting to break one. Purple Paper Parallel Perdomo. <laughs> yeah, say that one five times fast. So break one. Here's who's in break one. Giovanni, Goth Duck, Travis N, Chris D, JR's Cards, Bethany, J Chez, Clark Sports Cards, Medium Rare Cards, The One Spot Hot Shot, Jeff Pullins, Captain John's Cards, Tyler C, Zach O, Joe M, San Antonio Chris, and Jeremy R. So that's who's going to be breaking with us in break number one. Most of you guys, I believe all of you have been in a break before, but just to go over what we're going to do here, we're going to roll the dice twice. We'll randomize the teams first, and then we'll randomize the break participants second. And uh, the dice will tell us how many times we're going to randomize each. So let's start with that. And our first roll going to be a four. So we'll randomize teams four times. And this is where I wish I had my second screen. I'm playing on a brand new computer tonight. My second screen, I can't find the driver it's, dri it's driving me nuts, no pun intended. But we'll make it work. All right, so here we go. Uh, we can shut that down now, I believe. Um, all right, so here we go. Here's all of our teams. Oh, wait, see, I already did. Oh, wait, I did switch it. I did switch it. See, so much. I'm so used to the two screens now, it's going to drive me nuts. All right, so here we go. Here's all of our teams. Going to randomize it four times. One and two and three and four. All right, we got Tigers on the top, Nationals on the bottom. One thing to remember we've got two different years worth of cards here. So, a lot of you have been in Bowman breaks lately, and I know you know what the teams to search for in Bowman. But remember, we're also looking for 2021 or 2020 rookies out of top series one. So those are different sets of teams that you'd be looking for. So, all right, here we go. Roll the dice again for the break participants. We're going to come up with a three. We'll do that real quick here. Pull it up. Start a new list. And lots of cards to get to. Lots of cards in this break. Everyone's going home with cards. I guarantee that. Here we go. One. Two. And three. All right. We've got Zach O on the bottom. Jeff Pullins on the top. And hopefully by next week, I can get that second screen back up. That'd be great. All right, so let's do this. Let's hide this so we can see. I'm going to pull chat back up just like the old days. We've got chat right here. We're going to open this up for trades. I'll alphabetize the list here for you real quick so it's easier to find teams. And here's how the break comes out. We've got... The Angels going to medium rare cards. We've got the Astros going to Clark Sports cards. The A's going to Clark Sports cards. 
Blue Jays to Medium Rare Cards, Braves to Jay Chez, Brewers to San Antonio Chris, Cardinals to Clark Sports Cards, Cubs going to Chris D, Diamondbacks to Joe M, Dodgers to Got Duck, Giants to Jay Chez, Indians to Chris D, Mariners to Medium Rare Cards, Marlins to Giovanni, the Mets going to Bethany, we've got the Nationals going to Zach O, the Orioles going to Tyler C, the Padres to Got Duck, Phillies to Captain John's cards. Ahoy, Captain. We've got the Pirates going to JR's cards. The Rangers going to Captain John's cards. Rays going to San Antonio Chris. Red Sox to Giovan. Reds to Jeremy. Rockies to Zach O. Royals to Travis N. Tigers going to Jeff Pullins. We've got the Twins going to Joe M. White Sox to Zach O. And the Yankees to Travis N. All right. So, we are open to trades. The first one I see here. Um... Chris Dempsey, I agree. There are no really bad teams in here um, because of the two years and because of the particular sets. That's kind of why I chose these two because um, it's pretty well-rounded um, on the teams. Okay, so first one I see here is Bethany. Mets for Cardinals. Cardinals, that is Clark Sports Cards. So Clark, Bethany, a huge Cardinals fan. She's got the Mets looking to make a trade. Jeff Pullins pulls in right on time. How's it going, bud? Jeff Pullins, by the way, you got the Tigers. Not a bad spot at all. So we'll see if we can get the Cardinals over to Bethany. Clark Sports Cards let us know on that one. It would be Mets for cards. And we'll keep it open here for a couple minutes. I do think I'm going to open up Series 1 first and then Bowman. And maybe we'll switch that up um, for Break 2. We'll see. Well, let's see. We've got how many? I mean, there are so many cards. 200, uh, 214. Checking the Angels score. Angels are going to lose. They won the first game. They had a doubleheader today. All right, so I want to check one thing. How many cards do we actually have here? 240 plus 24 times 14, 336 plus 240. Yeah, 576 cards in this break. Lots of cards. Sydney Martell, uh, while well, you pay for a break, um, I normally give all the payment info when I uh, announce the breaks over on Patreon. Um, the Patreons, more often than not, will buy up all of the spots. Occasionally, they make it over to uh, the YouTube channel. Um, and when they do, I give the payment information there. But um, everything's done through PayPal. So um, if you're interested in getting into a future One Cent Sports Cards break, check out the pinned comment at the top of the live chat. All right, so, um, um, Paco Acosta, Bethany, I got them last year, but in 2020 tops, there's the Nolan Ryan and the Mets. So uh, let us know, Clark, sports cards, because, Clark, you have the Cardinals. So let us know if you are willing to trade the Cardinals. Um, let's see. I'm not the Indian, so either with I'm happy. Yeah, exactly. Either way, I'm happy. Um uh, no, I will not trade for the Indians. Uh, I got Boba Chet's 2017 prospect card yesterday. Now I have all of the Boston prospect cards leading up to it. That's awesome. Dempsey, that's cool. That's a cool little... Um, Chris D's open to trades. Uh, Casey Nason, everything shipped today from the last break. Um, I've been... I actually wanted to get it out sooner, but I have... Two kids in baseball. My son this week is doing tryouts for hockey. Um, it's hockey tryout week, which is a big deal. That's for the season coming up. They do it at the end of the season because that's when the kids are playing their best. Um, my daughter is also playing soccer, and she is also – so we literally – tonight is like the only night I have been home um, in the last week. So – and then when I'm working all day, so it took me a little bit longer to get everything sorted. But yes, um, everything went out today. Tigers for Orioles. That is a Tyler C trade. We got the Braves for Mets. Steel City is in the house. Steel City, what's going on? Uh, 
Uh, sorry, not a med, uh, not a Mets fan. Sorry, but could do a three way for another player if interested. Um, Tyler, um, Tyler, are you lurking around? Um, you've got a Tigers for Orioles trade on the table. I am going to say trades going once because we do got to break these cards at some point. Yes, lots of kids and lots of, well, it's only two kids. They're just in, each kid's in lots of sports. I, that will calm down. Soccer, I think, the, I think this is the last weekend of soccer. So soccer comes off the table this week. Hockey comes off the table next week or two weeks from now, I believe. Um, so then we'll just be doing baseball. Things will kind of go back to normal. But spring and youth sports um, are like peanut butter and jelly, man. You just, it's it's busy. <laughs> so, um I'm open with the Cubs for a three-way trade with the Mets. So here's what that would be. That would be a Mets-Cardinals-Cubs trade, which would mean, let me get this straight, which would mean um, Clark trades the Cardinals to Bethany, Chris Day gets the Mets, and Clark gets the Cubs. We can do that trade. It's a three-way trade. That'd be awesome if we do a three-way trade on this. Um, so that would be, so basically, that would be, um, yeah, Clark. So Clark Sports Cards, if you are interested in the Cubbies for the Cardinals, although the Cardinals would go over to Bethany, and the Mets would go over to Chris Day. We can get that done. That would be awesome. All right, so Clark says, I would do that. Um, as long as I don't get any cups, <laughs> of course we won't give you cups. Okay, so, all right, Clark Sports Card says he's okay with that. Um, I'm going to say that's confirmed. Okay, so here's how this works. Check it out. Watch the screen. So we know the Cardinals. Clark Sports Cards is going to jump into the Cubs spot right here. Chris D is going to jump into the Mets spot right here. And Bethany is going to jump into that Cardinal spot right here. So three-way trade. Let me get this all cleaned up. So I've got the Cardinals going to Bethany. I've got the Cubs going to Clark Sports Cards. And I've got the Mets going to Chris Day. Three-way trade. That is not, that won't hurt your brain that hard. Okay, we're going to say trade's going twice. I don't see a lot of other ones on the table. And Bethany gets her Cardinals. We've got them. Well, that was a fun one. That's a fun one. Not often do we see a three-way trade. Um, the old menage a trois of the, of the uh, breaker world. Is that a first? I believe we've had one or two in the two years that I've been breaking. <laughs> in fact, I, I also, but it's possible. I believe I'm like coming up on my two year anniversary, like in the next, it's in the next month or two. Um, I got to go back and see when my first one was. I believe it was, I want to say it was like mid July 2019. Uh, and I think we're going to say trades are closed because we could sit here and stare at, let's see, we could sit here and stare at spreadsheets or we could stare at cards instead. So let's close up trades. Lots of jokes, lots of jokes. All right, so let's get back to it. And let me see if I can this up right for you guys I believe it's gonna work I believe that will work for you guys we can see everyone that's in the break that's awesome let me get chat pulled up here and we are gonna break okay so like I said we're gonna do tops series 1 2020 first we'll do Bowman second 
We are guaranteed to get either an autograph or a relic. Put this up here. Um, where do I want to put that? Here. It's going to be off screen, but it's okay. It's right here. It's right there. You can see the corner. Ding, ding, ding. Okay, so here we go. And as always, before I break, uh, thank you to all the patrons for all of your support. I know I've been busy lately, have not been as active as I normally am. Like I said, the U Sports plus a home remodel have kept me very busy. Um, but I'm glad I... It, it's always fun ripping cards with you guys, so thank you very much. I appreciate all the support. Hopefully we can get some bangers out of here, um, get some fun cards for you guys, and I appreciate you hanging out on the channel for a little bit. Been a while since I've opened some 2020 Series 1, so it'll be nice to kind of take a little trip down a recent memory lane. We do get the one silver pack. I'll save that to the end. And the good old, almost iconic purple. And I always like these packs because they remind me of my logo a little bit. They use kind of the same color scheme as the one cent logo, like that dark bluish purple and, and lime green color. Um, if you go back, way back on the channel, you'll see why my logo is what it is. Um, I did not design it, but a guy by the name of Matt Holly did. All right, so we're going to pull these over to the side on top of the Bowman pack, and we will get started. First pack, break one. Jeremy would love it if you did join. Um, there's a Discord community. It's very active. It is a fun, fun group to be a part of. Um, you can join for as little as 2 bucks a month, but no pressure. Uh, there's... Um, I get it if people don't want to join. Um, and our first card, break one, Jason Kipnis. And right off the bat, Bobo, Bobachette, rookie card. Who got the Blue Jays? The Blue Jays, by the way, a very, very good draw. The Blue Jays going to medium rare cards, a.k.a. Michael A. So we get Bobo right off the bat. A beautiful Beau Bichette. That's going to the card garden. We'll start him back. Let's see. Let's start it. We'll start him back in this corner. There we go. All right. Here we go. Sonny Gray. Fernando Tatis Jr. Tops All-Star Rookie Cup. Going to the Padres. Going to Goth Duck. So Tatis second year card. And Tops starts off strong. Three cards, two top loaders. Uh, Tyler Beatty, uh, Cattell Marte, future stars, Chris Paddock, Jorge Polanco, Sterling Marte, Brandon Crawford had a big day today, six RBIs. We've got an Austin Meadows and a Derek Dietrich. Um, I want to just check the numbers on these real quick. 68. Okay. Derek Dietrich, and this is going to be a gold. This was one of the knocks on 2020 is the gold was more brown than it was gold. But this one's going out to the Reds. This one's going to Jeremy. Jeremy's got a couple spots in the next break. This one's numbered 1384 out of 2020. And I believe this, let me check this Austin Meadows. I think this Austin Meadows, did we really start off this hot? Um, I can't. I'm so old. Look at old me, old me. That is a 60, I still can't read it. 69, okay. So no, that is not a short print. Um, I thought the Austin Meadows might be a short print. We also got a Jake Rogers. Did, did we have to go over the Jake Rogers? And the Whit Merrifield. So that's a nice rookie card right there of Jake Rogers. The Derek D Dietrich to 2020. Let's get organized here. Dustin, what are we doing? So first pack. Nice one. Tatis, Dietrich, Bobachette. And we get Tim Anderson. Another great season from him. Manny Machado, Dwight Smith, Santana, Longoria, Zimmerman, Abraham Toro, rookie, New York Yankees team card, Cardinals team card, close call. And we have Scott Kingry and the Decades Next 2020. 
Shohei Otani going to the Angels. That's going to medium rare cards. Pulls that halo spot down. Other Jeremy. Yes. <laughs> so there's a nice Shohei. 2020. And we get a Sam Hilliard rookie card. And an Enrique Hernandez doing some sort of stuff with his legs. Trying to avoid the slide. Next pack. Chapman, Towers, Sanchez, my favorite Ronald Acuna Jr. card, the 2020. Just a cool card. Beautiful card going out to the Braves. Let's go into J. Chez. We've got Adalberto Mondesi, Jose Urena, and there's Randy Arozarena on the Cardinals. Rookie card, Arozarena. Beautiful one here. This one's going to Bethany. She landed those Cardinals. And the Arosa Reina, the lesser known Arosa Reina rookie. This one's also an update, but it is a rookie of him while he's on, obviously, the Rays. Um, I'm going to move this pack down here because we know it's going to be the last one, just so we can keep the card garden moving. Um, I didn't even finish that pack. What am I doing? All right, Eric Fetty. Mashihiro Tanaka, so, oh, but a Rosarena did start on the Cardinals. Ian Desmond, Luis Castillo, and Jordan Alvarez. And this would be considered a rookie card. This is the Tops Now. First MLB home run highlights top prospects debut. And if I could get the top loaders out, that would be helpful. What is, look, look at that piece of plastic just sitting in the top loader box. I swear, sometimes they're the plastic shards that come in the cardboard gold boxes. So is Jordan Alvarez for Clark Sports Cards. And we've got future stars Michael Chavis and Brian Anderson. Next pack going to be A. Garver, Davis, Ahmed Rosario, Tyler O'Neill, Thornton, Max Muncy, Andreas Munoz, rookie card. Yolmer Sanchez, Zach Collins, rookie card. For the White Sox, going to Zach O. All right, then we've got Matt Carpenter, Craig Kimbrell, and a nice second year Vladdy Guerrero Jr., 85 parallel. Another nice one for the Blue Jays. The Blue Jays, probably uh, in this break, would be considered the most valuable spot because they're valuable in this one and in the Bowman. Um, let's see, we've got Moustakis and Max Stassi. Um, how the Max, did Max Stassi have a 2019 rookie? I feel like that's his rookie card right there. Um, but maybe I'm wrong. Kashner, DeGrom, David Bote. Uh, Archer, Master and Apprentice, Scherzer, Guriel Jr., Danny Holson for the Cubs. That is a rookie card. The Brewers, Christian and Nolan, like father, like son. And that is a Beau Bichette, Kevin Biggio. It's a cool card right there. That one's going to the Blue Jays as well. And speaking of Kevin Biggio, there's the future star. We've got Adrian Morjan, rookie card, and Daniel Palka. Polka, polka, polka. Next pack. Jose Peraza. Kirby Yates. John Gray. Michael Brousseau, rookie card. Chance Sisko. Nick Solak, rookie card. Nice one for the Rangers. Got the Rangers in this. That's Captain John's card. Solak. I remember last year saying Solak is one to keep an eye on. I, he's been playing for two years. He plays great. He's a great, great ball player. Um, so we get the Solak rookie. Jay Bruce. Robel Garcia rookie. Yasmani Grandal. Tyler Naquin. Lucas Giolito. And a nice little catfish hunter. Decades best from the 70s. 
That one's going to the A's and going to Clark Sports Cards as well. Ian Kinsler and Matt Barnes. Next pack. Let's see what we can get here. Daniel Murphy. Bobby Bradley, rookie. Andrew Haney. Bubba Starling, rookie. Martinez, Keller. Annabel Sanchez. Yadir Molina. No, it is not a short print. Astros team card, Nationals team card. Another rookie card of Rogelio Armin, uh, Armenteros. I remember I had a problem with that one last year. Still have a problem with it. And we have a black border for the Reds. Barry Larkin, 1990s decades best. Black border of Hall of Famer Barry Larkin. This one's going to Jeremy, and it will be numbered... 95 out of 299. Beautiful Barry Larkin right there. Love that card. That is a sweet one. Congratulations on that, Jeremy. I landed that red spot. We've got Hector Neris and Benintendi having a little bit of a season that is, well, may, that will make him forget about 2020. Had an abysmal 2020 season. Got himself traded. Um, all right, here we go. AJ Puck, rookie card. Sandy Alcantara, he's pitching tonight or pitched earlier today. I think it was tonight. Frankie Lindor, Jose Barrios, Marwin Gonzalez, Cabrera, Shohei Otani, Buster Posey, Matt Olson. We have Dominic Smith, Josh Van Meter, and a Whit Merrifield 85 for the Royals. It's got the Royals. That's going to be Travis N. <laughs> nice other Jeremy. I love it. <laughs> We're going to call him Jeremy 1 and Jeremy 2. All right. Cesar Hernandez and Anthony Santander. Let's see if we can get a Sensatella. And the huge pull emoji comes out. I love it. Jeremy immediately using the emojis. Luke Jackson. Mike Tockman, David Price, Roman Quinn, Jack Flaherty, Brandon Dreary, Eloy Jimenez. That is that all-star rookie cup. Another nice one for the Sox. And Zach O. We've got Isan Diaz, rookie. We've got a John Lester. A Charlie Kluberson. Kluberson. Jackie Bradley, and we have, oh, look at this one. This is a sweet one. A rainbow foil, Miguel Cabrera for the Tigers. Future, I mean, first ballot Hall of Famer. Guy won a triple crown. And that is a rainbow refractor, Miggy Cabrera. Nice one there. Always nice to get Hall of Famers parallels. Mike Fires and David Peralta. All of the awesome emojis are you would need to be a member of the YouTube channel, not Patreon. There's two different ones. One of these days I'm actually gonna clean that up. I need to choose one or the other. I would probably choose Patreon uh, because it allows me to do a lot more. Um, Alex Cologne, but you kind of get it gifted to you when you hit a certain number of subscribers. And then it says, hey, you can offer things like emojis and stuff like that. Joey Lueschi, uh, Jameer Candelario, and a Brendan McKay rookie card. This one's going to the Rays in San Antonio, Chris. Iris comes in with some drinks and says, nice. Aroldis Chapman, Malik Smith, Jeff Smarja. Ian Kennedy, Max Kepler, Jameson Talion, Andrew Miller, and so um, a nice 1990s Ricky Henderson. And we've got Michael Pineda and Javi Baez. Right, next pack. Marinzik, Patrick Sandoval, David Fletcher, Anthony K rookie, Mauricio Dubon rookie, the Bryce Harper. 
Michael Givens, Starlin Castro. We got the Red Sox team card, Phillies, Manny being Manny, Daniel Men. I've never been able to, uh, Megden, um, Chase Anderson, and Christian Stewart. We're about already halfway through series one after this pack. Like I said we're going to move a little bit faster tonight. Verdugo, Senzel, good one. Tony Gons, a Gonsolin rookie card. This one's going to the Dodgers. It's got the Dodgers. Goth Duck pulled that Dodger spot. Still looking for an auto or a relic. We've got Jordan Yamamoto. That's another rookie. Miles Mikolas. And a nice one here for the Blue Jays. The big Vladdy Daddy. It's not Vladdy Daddy. It's Vladimir Guerrero. Vladdy Daddy is his daddy. Um, <laughs> but this is a nice second year of Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Tops All-Star Rookie Cup. Another one for medium rare. We've got Zach Wheeler, Marquez, Jake Lamb, Ben Gamel, and a Chris Paddock 85. Got to get some more penny sleeves out. Good news is they're right here. And it's together, get them together. Uh, I messaged you on Instagram or Patreon. Uh, are you able to see it without messing up your screen, stream? Um, sure, I can check that real fast. Uh, well, where was the message? Um, <laughs> well, it was not on Instagram, I don't believe. Um, so hold on, hold on. Too many. Did you message me? Um, well, I don't see it. Um, I got to keep moving. All right, here we go. Jose Urquidy, rookie, rookie card. Can't speak. George Springer. All right, next card. Still looking for, hopefully we get an auto. That'd be sweet. Nick Paveda, Dietrich, Matt Stram, Trey Turner. Jose Quintana, James Paxton, Dylan Cease, rookie, Jorge Soler, Anthony Rendon, Strasburg, Mitch Haniger, having a good season, and an Austin Barnes, and this is going to be a rainbow foil parallel as well. Uh, supported by YouTube solely for the fire emoji. I love it. I love it. Um. I'll send it to Patreon in a few minutes. That works. Okay. Um, so Matt Barnes, this one's going to the Dodgers and Mr. Goth Duck. Or Matthew P. as he's known on YouTube. So another rainbow foil. We've got Yuli Guriel having a good season as well. And Michael Baez, rookie card for the Padres. Next pack. Next pack. Good night. I think I'm going to move these cards after this pack too. Um, Nolan Arenado, Aaron Savale. Savale looked real good yesterday. I was watching the Angel game and the Lakers over at a buddy's house um, after the game. Um, one of the guys I coach with, and he, I live in Ohio, so the Indians Angels were on. Savale was good last night. Verlander, um, Omar Navarez. We've got Reese McGuire. There's Matt Thice. See, and this one has the rookie card logo. The other one did not. So that's interesting. I, I, could, I could have swore. All right, Daniel Vogelbach. And there's a Juan Soto World Series card. Nice Soto for the Nats. Going to Zach O. I think everyone calls him Vladdy Daddy, and his dad is now Vladdy Daddy's Daddy. <laughs> Tim Anderson, Jose Abreu. Glaber, that's a thir uh, third year card. Uh, there's a nice Willie Mays for the Giants. Going to Jay Chez. Decades best from the 50s. And we have Roberto Osuna and Josh Rojas. Rookie card for the Diamondbacks. Yeah, the Rainbow Foils were better in 2020 than they are in 2021. I, I believe that. All right, here we go. Nice one here. Aquino. Aquino, if you remember a year ago when Series 1 came out, this was one of the biggest pulls. Since then, 
Maybe not so much, but still plenty of time. All right, here we go. Luis Garcia, Austin Riley, Ryu, Ryu, I mean, Clevenger, we'll see him back next year, Billy Hamilton, Hanser Robles, Garrett Cole, it's almost weird seeing him in an Astros uniform now, Caleb Smith, there's Scherzer winning the World Series, Emilio Pagan, and a gold Kevin McCarthy for the Royals. This one will be numbered. This one's going to Travis N. Jeremy Little with the Soto. Gets the Soto. That was quick, Jeremy. That was awesome. All right. By the way, the Soto one, I made that emoji all by myself. This one's numbered 801 out of 2020. The Kevin McCarthy. That one going to the Royals, like I said, and Travis. And we'll finish that pack with a little Tommy LaStella action and Sean Murphy. Already kind of one of the better catchers in the American League. I'm going to move these out of the way here real quick. Just so we can see the cards a little better. There we go. Get them over on the other desk. Problem is the other desk is so far away. So far away from me. Little dire straits action. Sorry about that. Trevor Richards, Kenta Maeda, Mike Yastrzemski, future star, uh, Larry Garcia, Nick Lopez, Sean Doolittle, Brandon Belt, Verlander league leader, Brock Holt hanging in the rain with the Red Sox, Trevor Bauer, CJ Cron, and a Robel Garcia 85 rookie for the Cubs. Going to Clark Sports Card, trade it into that spot. So a nice 85 Robel, Robel Garcia. Um, we've got Jock Peterson and Jeff McNeil, future star as well. Series two, our next release. Um, next release, there's a couple uh, releases coming out. The releases have been all over the board. The next big one from Tops that is coming out is Tops Finest. I believe that comes out on the 3rd. Then on the 9th, we are scheduled for Series 2. We'll see if that actually sticks. There's been a lot of production issues. Uh, Carlos Rodon threw a no-hitter a couple weeks ago. Renfro, Kyle Hendrick, Pete Alonzo, Merrill Ke Kelly, Ken Giles, Tyler Glass now, Nola, Willie Adamas, Chicago Cubs team card, Tim and Yolmer. A nice looking card and the home run challenge card from last year. That one's of, of Paul Goldschmidt. Don't know that those would work this year, but still kind of a cool little Paul Goldschmidt action right there. JT Riddle and Shane Bieber. This is when 2020 card. This was his stats from this year. Amazing going to the Indians. That one's going to Chris D. Otani, three strikeouts today. That's rare. The Gypsy Queen does come out. Normally, it comes out early in the season. It got delayed. I believe it's coming out in July. July? I think it's July. may even be August now. Everything got delayed. There's a lot of production delays because of plastic, because of the wrapping, um, paper, um, just like everything else. They're taking a lot longer to get stuff. I'm, eventually, they're going to have to start canceling sets. Uh, Raphael Devers, Real Muto, Granky. You say Kikuchi all the time. Nice one for the Braves. A little Mike Soroka. M -m -m Mike Soroka. You like singing tonight, I guess. Um, I've made dire straits. My goodness. Um, Adam Frazier, Tommy Edmonds, Strasburg, Orlando Arcia. My least favorite card from 2020. I don't know why I don't like that card. Just too much dirt. It looks dirty. But we got a Wade Davis and a Jose Altuve. Forget, uh, that's right. These were the um, what are the top's choice through the years cards. So this is a 2008 design, Jose Altuve for the Astros. That's going to Clark Sports Cards, and we have an Austin Nola rookie and a Jesse Winker. Round out that pack. Still looking for a lot of big rookies. Gavin Lux. Let's see if we can get one. Let's see if we can get one here. All right, here we go. Tyler White, 
There's Dustin May. Unfortunately, he's out for the season. Uh, but this is his rookie card. So there's the May. We've got Hunter Dozier. Patrick Corbin. Jesus Aguilar. He's having a good season as well. Jorge, Jorge Alfaro. Zach Gallen. Hopefully Gallon comes back. Every time he pitches, he's one of the best pitchers in the league. This is a nice one here for the Diamondbacks. That one's going to Joe M. Yeah, um, yeah, um, so let's see. Did Jeremy say? Yeah, so what are some of the other? It's, June is chock full of releases. If they actually can stay on the release calendar, um, here's Jacob w w Waguspek. And it looks like we're going to have our hit in here. Here is the Angels team card. So we'll pull that to the back. Uh, we've got Jake Arietta and Christian Vasquez. Like I said, the Angels team card. And our hit will be for the Orioles, Trey Mancini. And this is a Jersey game used memorabilia for the Baltimore Orioles going to Tyler. C. Tyler, congrats on that one. Let me get a some scissors here real quick. Got a different way to do the... So we end up with a relic in this box. Well, I'll take a relic. Um, little game used Trey Mancini. Trey Mancini, a great comeback story. Um, had had um, some issues, some cancer where you don't want cancer. <laughs> but he's back. He's playing. It's fantastic. So a nice Trey Mancini there. Congrats on that one, Tyler. So there is our relic. So we get a relic. We'll see if we get an auto out of the next one. We still got five packs to go in a silver pack. Looking. I'm looking for Jordan, man. Where's, where's my Jordan? Speaking of rookies, though, there's the Nico Horner. Nicola Horner. So there's Nico. That one's going to the Cubs. That's going to Clark Sports Cards. We've got Justin Turner, Oscar Mercado, Garrett Cooper, Liam Hendricks, soaking it all in Yankees card, and Juan Soto. Another Soto action. Like that one. They picked some good photos for Soto and Acuna in 2020. That is for sure. Uh, Kevin McCarthy. We've got Hollywood Heroes. And Big Air, Big Hair. Austin Barnes. And we've got a nice one. A Dale Murphy 85 for the Braves. We've got Blake Trainin. And Nick Markakis. Panini has Optic Select and Prism. Yeah, but um, of all of those, like I know um, they've got Prism and Select coming out on the same day. So there's no way that's going to happen. There's absolutely no way that happens. Maybe it will, but I doubt it. Um, all right, here we go. Brad Hand. Dario Agrizal, rookie. Rasil Iglesias, Anthony Rendon, Vargas, Matthew Boyd, Dansby Swanson, Amir Garrett, Eduardo Rodriguez, Ryan Presley, and there's Trent Grisham. Nice one. Nice rookie. This one's actually going to the Brewers, not the Padres. This is still his Brewers card. So this one goes to San Antonio Chris. So a nice Grisham. There's one of the rookies we're looking for out of here. And we have another very nice rainbow foil for the Braves. M -m -m My Soroka rainbow foil. Not numbered. However, always cool to get an all-star rookie cup parallel for Mike Soroka going to Jaychez. So our foils have been pretty nice. I'll take it. And we have Luke Voigt, the 2020 home run leader, and an iconic Mike Trout photo as well. Round out that pack. Next pack. Um, you did on the second. Uh, did I miss it? Um, 
I thought I missed the Orioles. Um, what are we talking about? What are we talking about? Let me get caught up here. For a second, I thought that Murphy was John Waytham. No, no, this is not Jab's channel. Come on, Albert Almora, uh, Josh Bell, Johnny Villar, Robbie Cano, Seth Brown, rookie card, Kenley Jansen, and there he is. We've been waiting quietly. Matt's been waiting. There's the Gavin Lux rookie card going to Goth Duck Matthew P. So there's the Lux. We were getting a little late in the box, and I was like, hmm, are we going to get him? Are we going to get him? Well, we got him. All right. We've also got Mr. Kirk Suzuki, the Dodgers team card, Christian Yelich, Travis Demerit. That's a rookie. And look at this one, a sweet one for the Pirates, Honus Wagner. On base slugging percentage. This is the on base, or this is the uh, decades die cuts that they had last year. Very cool ones. Um, that one is a sweet one. That is the Honus Wagner for the Pirates. Going to JR's cards. We also have Brandon Woodruff and Nelson Cruz. Next pack will have. I can get it open. Next pack, going to have Julio Teheran, LeMahieu, Judge, Belly. Some nice, some nice cards right through there. Those are big names. Ryan Yarbrough, Lewis Brinson, Young, Johnny Cueto, Indians, A's, Robbie Grossman, and Pete Alonzo. This, I believe, if I'm not, this is this is either an awesome card or a gross card, depending on if you like man bodies or not. <laughs> so this is the Pete Alonzo Tops All-Star Rookie Cup. And it is a short print Pete Alonzo All-Star Rookie Cup. I want to look it up. The number on this, gosh, my, I'm, I'm telling you, they print it so small, I cannot see it. I think it's 84. Um, and I believe 84 is the SP, not the SSP. But a beautiful, this is the last card of the set, too. Uh, card number 350, Pete Alonzo. This one going to the Mets, traded for the Mets. Chris D trades into that Mets spot and gets the Pete Alonzo short print. Um, I'm going to look it up here real fast. Let's see. We've got 2020. I just want to look up the number. 2020 tops. Series 1. That's a sweet card right there. Um, SP. Um, I'm going to say image variations. Let's see. Let's see. It will be... We'll find the back. Where's the Beckett one? Give me a break. There it is. Um, 2010. Oh, that's because I put 2010. Womp, womp. Don't know how to type. Hold on. I'm on my phone. Now the top's one. Okay, so here, we'll bring it down here. Um, image variation. Let's just see here real quick. Boy, that your damn will be. Hey, look at That's the one we just pulled. Hey, what the heck? All right, here we go. So the numbers will be SP variations, 284. So it is the SP. So we're looking for 285 would be the SSP. All right. So the Pete Alonzo, congrats on that one, Chris. Um, That's right. It is the, I think, no, I think that's the super, super, super short print. That is the actual polar bear. Yoan Moncada and Framil Reyes. Um, so I think it's the polar bear. That is the SSSP, which is like the first year they had the SSSP last year. Um, super duper, super short print. All right, here we go. Last pack before we get to the silver pack. Good luck, everyone. Ryan Braun, Alberto, Michael Comforto, Anthony Rizzo, Austin Hedges, Aaron Hicks, Jacoby Jones, Jalen Davis, rookie card. We've got Tommy Pham, Anthony Rendon, Andrew Shafin, 
Chris Sale, 85. We've got David Dahl and Adbert Alzale as the rookie card for the last pack. And now we get to the silver pack. It said, I have too many cards already. It was my, it's all, it's Mama Royale's fault. Um, all right, so here we go. Let's see what we get out of here. Silver pack, 85 mojos. We're going to get a Manny Machado. We're going to get some color. We get Manny Machado. We'll go like this. So we get a Machado, 85. We get a Glaber, 85, Mojo. Going to the Yankees and Travis. Nice one there. And a Frank Thomas. And the blue will be, let's see, it's going to be a Dodger. It looks like a redhead. It's going to be a blue Dustin May. Silver pack going to the Dodgers, going to Got Duck. Beautiful one there. It will be numbered to 150. It is 120 out of 150. A Dustin May Blue Mojo Refractor. Silver pack refractor. Sweet one there. Let's get Frank Thomas wrapped up as well. So a nice Frank Thomas for the White Sox. That's going to Zach O. Another Hall of Famer there. And that ends the first box out of break one. We've still got Bowman to go. Not a bad box. However, I would have liked to have seen a couple more of the big rookies. But we did get a few of them. Um, got enough of them. Had some nice silvers. Um, or rainbows, I mean. Did get the Barry Larkin, uh, the short print Pete Alonzo. That was a sweet one. Uh, we had the Trey Mancini. That was our patch. The Bo Bichette, the Randy Arosa Rainier rookie, Derek Dietrich to uh, 2020, the Barry Larkin black border to 299, the Miggy Cabrera rainbow, Kevin McCarthy to 2020, Soroka. That's a sweet one right there. The rainbow foil, the Dustin May mojo, blue mojo to 150. Gavin Lux rookie, Pete Alonzo short print, the Trent Grisham rookie, and the Austin Barnes as well. Not to mention a few others littered throughout here, the Nick Solak and stuff like that. So that's going to be our, that will be over here. That's going to be the top. So tops didn't do bad. Let's see if Bowman can beat it. We'll run it from the top one more time to get an undisputed champ for the night. All right, so here we go. It's Bowman time. We have opened quite a bit of Bowman over the last month on this channel. Um, I think we've gone through, well, we've gone through more than half a case on the jumbos and i think this is our fourth hobby box we've opened on the channel um let's see what we can get out of here so teams stay the same so you keep your team in this one and now we switch our we switch our minds to prospects however still plenty of rookies in here as well so let's see what we can let's see what we can do all right. Jeremy Little, the Joe Cry Baby. Love it. All right, here we go. Bowman 10. We're going to start with Cody Bellinger, Josh Donaldson, Aaron Nola, Joey Gallo, and Brennan Davis, Bowman Scouts Top 100. That one's going to the Cubbies. Uh, Dodgers were well, uh, represented nicely. They did. I agree. The Dodgers. Uh, we're going over there. Uh, speaking of the Dodgers, we've got Josiah Gray and Tyler Callahan and Justin Foscue as our Chromes. Fradius Nova, Cade Cavalli, and Christopher Morrell 
first Bowman. So we are guaranteed one autograph out of this box. Hopefully get some parallels. We do, Keep in mind, hobbies have the to 25 parallels. That's always what I'm looking for in the hobbies. Um, so we'll see if we can get one of those as well. We've got Yadir Molina, Frankie Lindor, J.D. Martinez, Austin Hayes, Alec Bohm, Rookie of the Year favorite. Sit back a little bit. That's a nice one there for the Phillies. Going to the captain, Captain John's cards. Page and Ace and Jeff uh, said, send all of them, but I'll keep the printing plate. Said she'd send, um, all right, so there you go. Alec Bohm, that'll be our first one up in the card garden tonight. We've got Patrick Bailey and for the Orioles, Heston Kerstad. Nice one here. So Bowman starting off on the right foot as well. Very much like the, that series one box where we had that killer, killer first pack. Um, we'll take a Kerstad. go and we've got our next chrome which is going to be anthony volpe toglia george kirby and luis garcia next pack pack feels thick this pack is thick all right here we go something's weird about this pack i don't know what it is but this pack is thick max kepler let's count the cards one I think they're supposed to be 10, right? Um, supposed to be 10 in a pack. 10 cards, right. Okay, so Glaber's two. Blake Snell is three. Yu Darvish is four. We've got an Asa Lacey. See if we get lucky in this pack. So this is card number five. This Asa Lacey is a nice one, too. Going to the Royals. Going to Travis. Give Asa a quick top load here. 91. That was card number five. We got way more than 10 cards in here. We've got Drew Romo. This is our third Chrome, and there's still like four to go. What is wrong with this pack? This pack had a ton of cards in it. Brandon Marsh, Kristen Robinson. So that was, uh, Asa was five, right? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten 10 to the Chrome. So yeah, I had 13 cards in this pack. Kristen Robinson and all these Chromes. And a nice one here, a Max Meyer. So we got a ton of chromes in this pack. That is not supposed to happen. 13 cards in that pack. Max Meyer, that one's going to the Marlins and Giovanni. And we have a Leover Pagero, an O'Neill Cruz, Tristan Casas, and Seth Beer. So unfortunately, we didn't get five Bowman firsts out of there. But awesome that we got some extra cards. Like quite a few extras too. That was not like one. That was three. Um, and I believe we might be getting it again. So let's see. Joey Votto, Keston Hira, Buster Posey, Garrett Cole, Nick Lodolo for the Reds. We're going to Jeremy. That was one, two, three, four, five. Let's see. Six, seven, eight. Yeah, so we get 11 in this pack. So we've got an extra card in this pack as well. Oswaldo Peraza, uh, Daniel Espino, and... Yusniel uh, Diaz, Alexander Ramirez, that's a first Bowman, Keone Cavaco, and Brandon Marsh. So even though we're getting extras, not a lot of first Bowman chromes, well, not any actually, out of those two packs. This one feels normal. This one's going to have a Vladdy, a Luis Robert, a Freddie Freeman, Tanner Hoke rookie, Sam Huff rookie, Francisco Alvarez chrome, and a Jordan Walker. Drew Waters, Antonio Gomez, first Bowman, and Grayson Rodriguez. So interesting that we got a couple packs there with some extras. We'll see if we get a couple that are light that makes it even by the end of the box. It's not uncommon. I always like it. Sometimes you get lucky too. You'll get a couple extra chromes in there and they're all awesome. And you're like, sweet. All right, here we go. Evan White, rookie. Leody Tavares. Jazz Chisholm, rookie. Casey Mize, rookie. Nice uh, rookie lineup right there. Brennan Davis, Corey Albert. This one's going to the Cubs. And Alfonso Rivas. This one here for the Cubbies. Going to Clark Sports Cards. One cent. I'll catch up. I'll catch you up to speed 
I'll catch you up to speed of the chat between Jeff and I. Long story short, Mama is sending all the Oreo cards from the last break, except for the printing plate, to Jeff, because I already have too many. Okay, well, they have mailed out to you, so you got to mail them to them now. All right, so here we go. George Kirby, and we have Simeon Woods Richardson. That's a beautiful one there. Daniel Lynch, Simeon Woods Richardson paper, and Ronnie Marusio. Give me some more first Bowman Chromes. Let's do this. Let's go. We've opened a few packs already. It is time. It is time. And we got Austin Meadows, Bubik, Stevenson, Tejada, Joey Bart must be a Bowman box because Joey Bart is in it. Let's see if we can get two Joey Barts. I'll bet you we get two of them. There's Joey Bart. We've got Garrett Mitchell, and oh, we've got a sweet one coming up next. Sweet one coming up next on deck, incoming. How about that one? For the Mariners, medium rare cards, a Julio Rodriguez Atomic Refractor of Julio Rodriguez, and they're going to call him up this year. If they're calling up, Kelnick, they are definitely calling up Julio Rodriguez. Extra packs mean special packs later. Look at that thing. That is a beautiful, beautiful Parker Cards Breaks. How you doing, bud? That is a beautiful Atomic Refractor Julio Rodriguez going out to medium rare cards. We've got Royce Lewis, Adinso Reyes first, and Kristen Robinson. Bart loves Dustin, and Dustin loves Bart. <laughs> we've we've been we've been opening pack. Bart and I've been opening packs ever since he was the first Bowman. All right, Tariq Scooball, Clark Schmidt, Mackenzie rookie, Ian Anderson rookie. Then we have for the Giants a Ramos, Adon, and Corey talent pipeline. And for the Dodgers, there's our first, first Bowman Chrome. We've opened like five or six packs already. It just took a while, but it's going to be Jake Vogel. And that'll be a first Bowman Chrome for the Dodgers. So Goth Duck making some hay with that Dodgers spot. We'll take it. There's the Vogel first. We've got a Zach Bean paper and Alec Thomas. And Wander Time for the Rays. Shalaney is saying Julio will not get called up. Uh, everything I have read is saying he's getting called up on um, sometime this summer. Um, it, he may be a late summer call up, but if they keep staying in contention, um, and if they're fighting for a wild card, they, they would be hard pressed not to. Um, so we've got Wander Franco here. This one's going to the Rays, San Antonio, Chris, and we have our next pick. Still looking for, well, we did get the Julio Rodriguez. Let's find a numbered parallel. All right, here we go. Dalton Varsho, Singer rookie. Alec Bohm rookie. Bohm's bat starting to wake up a little bit. Um, he's had a little bit of bad luck. His, If you look at his advanced metrics, um, had a little bit of bad luck, but the bat's starting to come around. Balls are starting to drop for him. So we've got Alec Bohm. We'll keep Alec Bohm over here. Uh, we've got Nolan Arenado. Hey, speaking of Joey Bart, you can't get one. If you can get one, you can get two. Joey Bart, Rookie of the Year favorites going to Jay Chez. Nice one there. We've got Bo Naylor. Nice one here. Byron Laura. The Mariners won't bust their, their phone load in season one. Um, well, you're closest to them, so if the local guys are saying that they'll keep them down, I would believe that over national uh, reporters. There's Josh Jung, Manoa, and Callahan. Um, <clears throat> so, I mean, it's possible, but I don't know, man. Um, they sell a lot of tickets. If they fall out of contention, they could sell tickets that way, too. Um, Davey Garcia. There's Jake Cronenworth. Rookie card for the Padres. Goth Duck also has the Padres, so representing Southern California well. 
However, medium rare cards has the Angels. So there's Crony. We've got Luis Campusano, rookie. Ronald Acuna Jr. And Josiah Gray, Ronnie Marusio, and Freddie Zamora. Andrew Dahlquist, Bobby Witt, and Matt Manning. Get Bobby Witt in there real quick. Duck read my mind. The Shalani Times says he's staying down. Hot take. All right, here we go. Nate Pearson, rookie. Bogarts having a good season as well. We've got Paul Goldschmidt, Josh Bell, Mackenzie Gore. 91, another one for Goth Duck. We've got Austin Hendrick, Carson Tucker, Edward Cabrera, Matthew Libertore, and another Jake Vogel first. Next pack. Madrigal, Roche, Altuve, Alonzo, Taylor Trammell. I don't know why I just like instinctively sleeve these top 100s. They are sweet looking cards. Uh, Tyler Freeman, Jackson Cower, Ishmael Mania. That's a first. That's a Bitsko and a Casey Martin. Come on, first Bowman Chromes. What are we doing here? I think we've gotten one. We're like halfway through this box, we've gotten one of them so far. Something big's gonna, something big's gonna be coming up. That's that's what this means. Manny Machado, Luis Garcia. Sixto Sanchez, Jordan Alvarez, the Grom, CJ Chatham, Jordan Belazovic. We do have color coming up back here. Asa Lacey. Asa Lacey. Ace of Spades. All right, Jared Kelly, there's another first Bowman paper. And then we have a green. And this one is going to be Simeon Woods Richardson, numbered one. 74 out of 399 green lime green parallel paper parallel Simon Woods Richardson this one's going to medium rare cards second rounder in 2018 174 out of 399 not a bad little one right there little pitching prospect finally get some color up in here with some numbers on it. Now let's heat it up some more. See what we can get out of here. It's another thick pack. This one feels thick too. I think we might have another thick pack here. Shane Bieber, Yelich, Sean Murphy, Kyle Lewis, Max Scherzer. So that was four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah, twelve cards in this pack. So weird. This is a nice one right here, though. We've got Bobby Witt. Chrome, nice one. Four, who's got the Royals? I should know this by now. It's Travis. I would have to be sure. Um, they would have to be in the playoffs. I, I believe if they're in contention, it'll happen. Um, Matt Manning, Hunter Green, and Austin Wells are our Chromes. We've got a Tyler Soderstrom, Hunter Green, and Austin Wells paper as well. So they almost repeated themselves. And these thick packs, this might be another one. Still looking for our auto as well. So let's see what we can do here. We've got Soto. Let's see how many we get in here. Yeah. I don't know. We'll see. Aaron Judge, Yastrzemski, Bo Bichette, and look at that. There is our auto. Shows up. It is a first Bowman auto. It is going to the White Sox. And Zach O, it is a first Bowman auto for Jared Kelly. Always love it when the auto comes out and it is the first Bowman. It's awesome. Zach O had a little bit of a quiet night up till now, but he was drafted 47th overall. Jared Kelly, a good pitching prospect in that White Sox organization. So we get our auto. Maybe that's why that pack felt a little bit thicker. But that was, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, this one has 10. Um, now this one has 11. 
Brennan Davis, Tristan Casas, Westberg, Josiah Gray, and Francisco Alvarez. So we get our Jared Kelly auto. This one definitely has more than 10 cards. This one feels like it has 20. Um, <laughs> this one is nuts. There's a ton of chrome in here. All right. It's like they doubled up on the chrome in like half these packs. Mookie Betts, let's pay some of these off. Alex Bregman, Jose Abreu, Tatis. Let's pay some of these off with some chrome firsts. We're a little light on the chrome firsts. I'm not going to lie. Zach Veen. Nice one here for the Rockies. Going to Zach O as well. So Zach heating up in the late stages of break number one. Zach Veen, positional promise. Take that one. And we have Braden Shoemake, a Nolan Jones, a Gunnar Henderson, and a JJ Bladet. I think you're only supposed to get two chromes. We're getting we're averaging like four a pack. It's crazy. But none of them are first. Mario Feliciano. Pete Crow Armstrong and Tyler Freeman. Now, now I'm beginning to wonder what the pack should feel like. Um, this one, let's see. This one has, this one looks like it should be normal. Trevor Bauer, Soler, Jesus Sanchez, Alex Kirilov, Edward Cabrera. See, look at, I automatically sleeve them. It's like I. It's like it doesn't even matter whose name's on it. They get sleeved. There's the Cabrera. We've got an Alec Thomas and a Nick Bitsko and a Logan Gilbert. Still no first Bowman Chromes. We've had like one the entire box, I believe. That is not the auto. Um, yeah, it's one the entire box. Uh, Marco Luciano, Jordan Welker, and Bo Naylor. Now, we've got more packs. We can totally make up for it. But it seems odd that we've only gotten one, and we've had all these extra chromes coming out. So we'll continue on. Chris Bryant, Santander, Bobby Dahlbeck rookie, Christian Pache rookie, Pache, and we have Fernando Tatis Jr., 91 throwback. Goth deck. Take that one. Let's see if our chromes want to give us any first this time. It's almost like, almost like, I, I mean, I mean, it's, it's like going through a California drought here. Hello, Ramos and Hunter Bishop. Once again, no first. Uh, Geraldo Perdomo, Hello, Ramos, and Nick Gonzalez. Next pack. Oh, we gotta we gotta start getting some here soon, right? I mean, I guess that the card gods want to give us lots of chrome, just not lots of firsts. That's what's happening here. Matt, uh, we got Clevenger, Chapman, Baez, Merrifield. It's a beautiful looking one right there. It's a neat looking card. Rookie of the year favorites, Nate Pearson. Going to the Blue Jays. And medium rare cards. Sleeve might be worth more than the card that's in it, but I don't care. <laughs> now it's this one. This one looks a little different. That Nate Pearson one's sweet. Um, all right, so here we go. Some more chrome. We've got Matthew Thompson, D.L. Hall, and there we go. First Bowman, Kevin Alcantara for the Yankees going to Travis N. That's one of the nicer ones in this set. So we'll take that. Kevin Alcantara, congratulations on that one, Travis. Getting us out of that funk without getting a few first Bowmans for like half the box, man. Um, but we get Kevin Alcantara to get us off the snide. We've got Nick Maton. That's a first. Junior Severino first. And a Max Meyer. And let's do this. I'm going to pull these off to the side. Starting to hit them. Um, so here we go. And our next pack. These are all getting sleeved over here, by the way. All right. Let's keep the first. Let's keep the first rolling in this pack. Rendon, Mountcastle. We'll take that. 
sleepy first month or so, but he'll f snap out of it. We've got Javier and Braylon Marquez. Vidal Brujan, one of my favorite names from this set. Brujan. Cade Cavale and Corbin Carroll. CJ Ch uh, Chatham and Jordan Belazovich. And next pick. Shohei Otani. Charlie Blackman. Brian Anderson. Bryce Harper. Futurist Robert Hassel. Padres. Going to Goth Duck. Jackson Rutledge. Brett Beatty, Xavier Edwards, Matthew Thompson, and D.L. Hall. Our next pack. We're getting, we've got three packs to go in this box. Joe Adele. Here's that pack sequencing that you're looking for for the rookies. You've got the Joe Adele rookie going to the Angels, going to medium rare cards. Uh, remember one uh, thing about a Cali drought. It brings on Cali fire season. Yeah, and this year I hear it's going to be really bad because uh, you guys didn't get any rain out there again. We've got the Cabrian Hayes going to the Pirates. That's going to JR's cards. So the Cabrian Hayes rookie. Hayes will be back next month. We've got Spencer Howard rookie card. Cattell Marte. Corbin Carroll futurist. For the Diamondbacks, the Andrew Vaughn, uh, Andrew Vaughn's bat waking up. They've got him called up young. He's holding his own out there in Chicago. The nice Andrew Vaughn. Probably see his, I wonder if his rookie card will be in series two. That'd be sweet. Um, and we've got Nick York, another Chrome. We've got Ryan Valade, second there. And Yolbert Sanchez first, and Drew Romo. Next pack. We're going to have Jose Garcia rookie, Andreas Jimenez rookie, and Dylan Carlson rookie as well. Going to the Cardinals, going to Bethany. So Bethany gets a Dylan Carlson rookie. Get that one top loaded. And we've got Miggy Cabrera, CJ Abrams. There's a Jared Kelly first. And we have a blue right after that. So we'll switch that to the back. Here we go. Gabriel Arias first. Brennan Davis, Logan Davidson. There's the Jared Kelly. We'll get that sleeved up here, but he'll work as a reveal card for. Oh, that is a sweet one. That is an Asa Lacy, 130 out of 150 blue parallel. This one going to Travis. Travis continues the hot streak. Second to last pack, Asa Lacy, the ace of spades. Nice hit right here. Blue parallel, Asa Lacy. Fourth pick overall in 2020. Beautiful, beautiful. Blue, Asa Lacy matches the Royals blue. That's the one you're looking for. If it's the Royals, you want that blue on blue, blue Royals and the blue parallel match. Here's the Jared Kelly first. That one's going to Zach. So nice pull late in the break for Travis. Travis, congrats on that one, bud. There's the Jared Kelly. We have the Jared Kelly auto. And now we are down to our last pack of the box. Good luck, everyone. See if we get some last pack mojo going on here. And then we're going to go right in to break number two. Here we go. Another one of these packs that has a ton of cards in it. Kybert Ruiz. Luis Patino. Mike Trout. Ding! Got to be, I think that is our, what, third Mike Trout tonight? I normally like counting them. Luis Castillo. Marco Luciano. That's a nice one here for the Giants. 
Paradise Fire took out the entire town. Yeah, that's nuts. Um, the um, I'm actually going to be out in California in the middle of June. Marco Luciano. Um, I'm going out there for a wedding. Nick Gonzalez. That's a nice one. We have Emerson Hancock. And Christopher Morell. That's a first for the Cubs. It's going to Clark Sports Cards. And come on. Come on. There we go. Morell. That's a first. And we have Grayson Rodriguez, Blake Waltson, Carson Tucker, and our last card of the break going to be an Emerson Hancock. So that brings us to the end of the break. Which one was better? Um, I'm surprised. Well, well, that's actually kind of tough. Some of the, on both of them, we missed on some of the bigger cards. Like there's no Austin Martin that we pulled. Um, but we do get the auto out of Bowman. Um, so there's that. And we also got a few parallels. The Ace of Lacey was pretty nice. I think it's close. Uh, we got the Zach Veen, the Tatis 91, the Bobby Witt Chrome. Kevin Alcantara first. That's a nice one. That Ace of Lacey is sick. That 130 out of 150. Uh, Alec Bohm, Rookie of the Year favorites. The Julio Rodriguez. Uh, the Atomic Refractor. Jake Vogel first. Uh, the Simeon Woods Richardson, 174 out of 399 green. The Jared Kelly first. Bowman Otto. And, of course, all these other ones that we stacked up over here. Cronenworth Rookie. Cabrian Hayes Rookie. Dylan Carlson. Joe Adele. A few other first Bowman Chromes. Me, though, I'm going to make it interesting. And I'm going to say the Topps Series 1 box was the better of the two. So now, can Topps keep that going and break number two and claim the title? Can 2021 Series 1 bring down the vaunted Bowman 2021? Um, or 2020? Did I say 2020 Top Series 1? We're going to find out right now. So let's do it. Thank you again for everyone that got into break number one. Um, stuff can be replaced. People can't. That is a great way to put it. Um, all right. So there we go. Break number two. The only thing I personally own um, more than 11 of my uh, D&D &D books. D and D books have got it. Older ones have got to be pretty valuable now too, right? Um, all right. So let me get break number one shut down here. Real quick. One second. Say close. We will pull up break number two. All right. So here's a, here's who's in break number two: Jeremy R, Billy B, Still City, John S, Larry O, Tom L. Marshall C, Old Style 82, Chris D, Iris Collins. You guys know him as Bookworm. Um, Jeremy L, Brian Bosworth, Super, Paco, Roland T, Donnie B, Mark H, and J Chez 12. So let's get into it. So we have a few first time breakers in this break. So if you are lurking on the channel, haven't said hi, now's the time to say hi because. It is break time. Iris, I believe you're breaking with us for the first time as well, uh, but you've been hanging out for a while. I think Roland is breaking with us for the first time. Um, who else on here? I'm probably going to... Uh, Marshall is breaking with us for the first time. Um, Billy... No, Billy's broke with us before. Tom L? Tom? No, Tom's broke with us. Um... Roland Donnie, a Mark H, I think is also breaking with us. So Travis, um, thanks for hanging out. Congrats again. The fire continues for you. Always love it when you're hanging out. Um, I hope you have a good evening and a better weekend. Um, so here's how this is going to work for uh, the people that are in here for the break for the first time. We're going to roll a dice. We're going to roll this one, not this one. Um, but we're going to roll the dice. And we're going to roll it once to randomize the teams, roll it a second time to randomize the break participants. Um, and the dice will tell us how many times we're going to randomize. If we roll a one, we will roll it again because we need to, well, I don't need to, but we randomize it more than once. Um, 
And then that will tell us who gets what team and whatnot in the break. We'll open it up for trades for a little bit. If you didn't get the team you like, hit up the other people that are in the break. See if they'll trade the, for the team that you like. And if you both say, yeah, sure, I'll make that trade, we'll make that trade for you on the spot. So let's get to rolling. And our first randomization is going to be a six. So let's get that going. And what are we doing here? This pull up. There we go. There's chat. Doing this back on one screen. I it's it's funny because I've only had that second screen for like a month. And I'm already so used to it that now going back to how I used to do it feels odd to me. So here we go. We're going to do our teams. We're going to put them in six times. Put them through the randomizer six times. Here we go. One and two and three, four, five, six. All right, we got the Pirates on top, the O's on the bottom. Drop these in over here, like so. Come back over here and roll the dice again for our participants. And this time we're only gonna roll them twice for the participants. Down and dirty, here we go. All right, so let's pull this back up, there we go. Here's all of our participants and Randomize a new list. There we go. Two times. One and two. All right, we got Super on the top. Billy B on the bottom. My voice just cracked. I've, uh... It's springtime in Ohio. And I suffer from allergies. And I, uh, every once in a while... My voice cracks in the spring. It's so weird. And I think it's totally from allergies. So um, we're going to hide that. We will alphabetize and pull chat back up here. AC Nation Paco, are you keeping the two spots? Let me get caught up on trade here. So uh, Donnie says he will trade almost anything for the Reds. Um, John, it is the second for John. Okay, so here's how the break ended up. The Angels going to Jay Chez. The Astros going to Paco. A's going to Donnie B. Blue Jays going to Mark H. Braves going to Marshall C. Brewers to Jeremy. Cardinals to Larry O. Cubs going to Steel City. DW Diamondbacks to Jeremy. Dodgers to Steel City. Giants to Jeremy. Indians to Paco. The Mariners to Old Style 82. Marlins to John S. The Mets to Billy B. Nationals to Tom L. Orioles to Billy B. Padres to Jeremy R. The Phillies going to Iris Collins. Pirates going to Super. John S. with the Rangers. The Rays going to Tom L. Red Sox to Larry. Reds to Old Style. Rockies to Donnie B. Royals to Jeremy L. Tigers to Chris D. Twins to Roland T. White Sox to J. Chez 12. And the Yankees going to Brian Bosworth. All right, so we are opening it up for trades. Um, I can still send it to you. Uh, Paco says, let's get uh, let's get Justin to change it before the roll. Uh, well, that's too late. <laughs> so um, let's see. Donnie will trade the uh, Rockies for the Reds. Jeremy, uh, Jeremy gets the Brewers. Awesome. It's always fun when people get their favorite teams. Um, They've been popping in and out. I missed if you pulled a relic or an auto. We pulled a relic. It was a Trey Mancini relic. Um, from the top series one. It's kind of a cool one there, Trey Mancini, a good story. Maybe we get an auto out of this one. We will see. So if you would like to trade, um, let me know what the trades are. We'll do a double trade to old styles. So wait, you were looking, uh, Donnie, who are you looking for? You were looking for, um, hold on, I just read that. You would think I would remember. Hold on. Donnie was looking for the Reds, the Reds, the Reds, the Reds. So that's old style. Old style, you hanging out? If you're hanging out, Donnie would like the Reds. Yeah, 
They see you want the Indians or the Strohs. Um, Old Style says not trading the Mariners. Um, let's see, who's Donnie got? Donnie's got the A's. The A's are um, got a few of those 2020 rookies. Donnie had someone else. The Rockies. Um, is not trading the Mariners. I don't blame you. Reds and Marlins. The Marlins, uh, John S. has. Are my texts going through? Um, yes, old style, they are. I, they're at least coming through on my end. D-backs up for anything. Jeremy says D-backs for anything. So if you want the D-backs, hit up, hit up Jeremy. And let's see, I know you guys can't see this, but in three minutes, I've been following the 2021 top silver pack Joe Adele PSA Gem Min 10. 62 bucks. That's something I should bid on. I got three minutes to bid on it. I've been watching it. Still don't think, still think that's a little high. That card's going to go for like 90. Um, so let's see. Uh, D backs. Uh, Ira says, I'm not picky. You want the Phillies, Jeremy? Um, so I do Marlins for Reds. So John S. says he would do Marlins for Reds. Donnie, you, you good with that? Oh, wait. Marlins for Reds is old style. It is Donnie that is looking for the Reds. Jeremy Litter, so Jeremy says he will, uh, all right, so we're doing the Phillies for the Diamondbacks. Jeremy trading out of the Diamondback spot into the Phillies spot. Iris taking that Diamondback spot. Let's get that one in. It goes right there. Got that one in. First trade of break number two. All right. Jay Chez says he loves his teams. Got the White Sox. Let's get here too. Got the Halos. I like those teams too. Get this saved off. Just in case. Now there's going to be Diamondbacks fire, like the big unit. Yeah, um, the Diamondbacks actually are not a bad spot in either of these breaks. Um, we've got Zach Gallon in 2020. Um, all sorts of different things. So Old Styles, Old Styles got the Reds. Donnie's looking to get them. Uh, Donnie basically has the Rockies. And the A's. And I thought, do you not have, I thought you had someone else. Not seeing it. No. Big hitters, bubblegum and sports card said, start ripping. That's true. I should say trades going once. Celebrating my wife's 40th weekend. That, so you're in Florida. So what part of Florida? I thought that looked like Florida. Um, that, Actually, look like uh, West Palm Beach. Um, what what's that? What's that island out there? Um, I can't remember what it's called right now. I've been there too. Um, beautiful little island when you get when you're at West Palm Beach, and then you go out onto the little island that's right out from there. Um, is that where you're at? That's what it looked like to me. Any cards of Arenado in a St. Louis uniform? Yes, he's in a St. Louis uniform in uh, tribute, I believe.
Old style. John S. offered Marlins for Reds. I will do that. So, John S. Marlins for Reds. Clearwater by Tampa. Okay. John S., are you confirmed on that? Hex game. See, okay, so we're going to have to figure this one out here real quick. Because I think we've got two. So we do have two. Okay. Here's where the confusion is coming in. John S. is John Scola. S-K-O-L-A. See, because then we have a John S. John Schoonover. So Hex Game. Y-T. That is the John S. That I am, that I have in this break. I I I was looking at that just a second ago, and I was saying I think um so John hold on so John I'm gonna look you up here because I believe right so John Schoonover I do not have you in this break I have not received a payment on this break so we need to I'm gonna have to keep this in mind um. Because we now have two John S's, and I just it just now dawned on me. So we've got John Scola, um, who is in this break. John Schoonover, you are not in this break. So um, that is where the confusion comes in. I have not received a. I'm I'm looking at my PayPal right now. Um, so the last payment I have from Schoonover is on uh, May sixth. John Scola has paid on this. Has paid up on this break. Um, Royals for Indians is confirmed. We will get that one. Um, so that's why we have confusion. We have two people thinking they are John S. So let's see. Um, Royals for Indians. Royals. So Jeremy trading out of the Royals spot and into the Indian spot with Paco. Let's get that trade in, and then I think we're going to get to trading. Paco into that royal spot. Okay, trade's going twice. So we've got that trade in. And now I'm going to have to go over to See, this is where, this is where, um, this is where, let me see here. Um, this, this is where it gets interesting when you've got different names on discord versus Patreon and then versus, versus, uh, versus, um, Patreon, YouTube, and then discord. So hold on. I'm just checking and verifying. Uh what are we ripping? 2021 Bowman and 2020 Series 1. And now I see why this Okay, so now I see why this is happening. Okay, um so I've received payments from Hex Game. Billy says, what trades do we have so far? Um, we had the Indians trade. We've had two of them. Indians, Royals. What was the other one? Um, I'm actually trying to figure this out. I'm trying to get down to the bottom of the John S. mystery. Um, because I have been messaging with john who is the other john s that isn't in this break that's what i'm trying to figure out here um
All right, so I'm going to have to figure this out. And we're going to have to do it. And I got to get to the break. So here's what I'm going to do. Um, yeah, so I, what's interesting is the John S. The, I got it from John Scola. John Schoonover, I do not see a payment from you. So we're going to get these. However, um, I'm going to have to get this cleared up over on on uh, Patreon because we have two jo- uh, because we have John who I was actually texting and messaging with earlier today. So, uh, but I do not have a John Schoonover payment that I am seeing in PayPal. So these do go to John Scola, who is Hex. Um, I'm going to change that on here. So that's what's happening on this one. Um, should bring an SSP. Um, and Hex Game, you did you did uh, buy two spots. Um, and you have the personal. I have your payments for that. So I am seeing that in the system. Um, so anyways, that gets us cleared up. So I, I apologize for any confusion on that. But when we have two John S's um, in, in Patreon, it kind of... Um, and on PayPal, it kind of all shows up that way. So anyways, um, I, I just need to make note, note of that so we don't get that confused in the future. Um, all right. And, uh, so we are going to have to close trades, Donnie. I know you are trying to trade, um, but I think he has said no on that. So we are going to close trades because we do got to get to ripping guys. All right. So here we go. First of all, thank you for everyone that got in the break. Sorry for a little bit of the confusion there. Um, I, I will go in after the break just to make sure I have everything straight. Um, I, I, um, John S, not Hex, the other John, um, John Schoonover. I believe you, I was tech, I was messaging with you today. Um, but maybe I'm wrong on that. Maybe I just have this all backwards, but, um, I was looking at John S and I may have gotten them confused. So um, I apologize if I was sending messages to the wrong person. Okay, so let's get into the break. Everyone that is in break two, thank you very much. Um, We're going to get to breaking. This time, I think we're going to do Bowman first and we will end the night on 2020 series one. So let's break into some Bowman. Um, We're going to pull this up. uh, uh, Let's see, how far can we pull it off to the side? I'm going to pull it off right there. Uh, Let me pull this up. And we'll go like this. I believe you guys will be able to see it. There we go. And pull up some chat here. So let's pull some fire. Let's find out. So we're I'm giving break one a slight advantage to the tops box. So let's see if Bowman can make a comeback or if Tops is going to steal the show over Bowman tonight. We'll see about that. But we're going to start with Bowman. And we're going to move on to tops to end the night. Good luck to everyone that is in the break. Thank you for everyone that got in. And good luck. So let's pull these out. We'll kind of stack them up over here. It's like they... All right. So. Pack number one. In Bowman, our first card from break number two, going to be a Christian Pache rookie. Not a bad way to start. And I just had a light go weird on me. I got all sorts of weird things going on over on my end of the world. There we go. Sometimes that light over there does that. It just like goes dim. Uh, We got Kybert Ruiz and Luis Patino. Let's do this the right way. Let's get set up straight to begin with. We'll be good later on. All right, Kybert Ruiz, Patino rookie. And there's Mike Trout, ding, number four on the evening. And a Nate Pearson rookie card. Nice one here for the Blue Jays. Going to Mark H has that Blue Jays spot. Yes, and John, I, I totally have you in for that. And um, it's this. I, so I apologize. It, I I was get as I started seeing it. I'm like I know I don't have, I I I knew I was straight on PayPal. It's the, it's the Patreon stuff that was screwing me up. Okay, so Nate Pearson is our first Bowman Scouts top 100. Then our Chromes. They are going to Jaron Duran and Julio Rodriguez. Nice one here. 
going to the Mariners, going old style. Um, are you able to do the personal after this break? Uh, what? Uh, yeah, let's see where we're at at the end of it. I mean, I, it, it's a school night. Um, so we'll just see where we're at. We'll see how I'm feeling. And then uh, you wanted just a blaster, right, KC? Um, Jeremy De La Rosa, Livier Pagero, and Patrick Bailey. Um, if it's just a blaster, I can probably get that done for you. Um, or I'll show you what I got. What I don't want to do is do one and then have a bunch of people be like, I'll take one too. Um, and then I'm up till two in the morning. That's not that's not a good idea. Luis Castillo, Cody Bellinger, Josh Donaldson, Aaron Nola, Joey Gallo. Oh, and are we gonna get it? Look at that. There was only one Chrome in that. But there's only one in that one. But if you're gonna get one, you're gonna get Austin Martin. That's the one you want. That's the one you're looking for. The Blue Jays starting off hot. Mark H. Congrats on that one. Austin Martin, first Bowman Chrome. Bingo. Bingo. Beautiful card there. Now that pack only had one chrome. The last box we had, it was giving us like five chromes a box. That one only had one. Michael Toglia, Jackson Cower, and Heston Kirsten. So Julio Rodriguez, Austin Martin. We also have Vladdy Guerrero. Luis Robert, Freddie Freeman, Tanner Hoke, rookie. Ryan Mountcastle, rookie of the year favorite. We've got Daniel Lynch and a first Bowman Chrome for the Rockies going to Eddie Diaz. Rockies are Donnie B's spot, so Donnie gets a first Bowman, Eddie Diaz. See how many firsts we get out of this box. Our last box that we did in break number one um, fell short of the mark, I'm going to say, on first Bowman's. I think we ended up with four total out of the whole box, which is pretty low. Daniel Lynch. There's Kevin Alcantara. That is a paper first Bowman and a George Kirby behind that. But Kevin Alcantara showing up in paper form for the Yankees going to Brian Bosworth. Um Sent a Patreon message. Yeah, I will look at that. Um, so there we go. I'm trying to, trying to, I'm still discombobulated from the John S. The who is John S. We could have wrote a book with how long it took me to figure that one out. Um, all right, I've got Sam Huff. Rookie card. Dalton Var Varsho rookie. Brady Singer and Alec Bohm. Rookie. That one's going to Jeremy in that Philly spot. If I can get a top, what is going on top? Okay, put the top loaders. There we go. Put the top loaders down, Dustin. All right, here we go. Alec Bohm, rookie. And we already have our auto. It is going to be a Daniel Montano. Now you can only get this as a auto. This one's going to the Rockies. This one's going to Donnie B. First Bowman auto. Auto only first Bowman. Let's figure out more about Montano. I'll be honest. I do not know a ton about him. A 2015 free agent rated as the number 16 prospect in 2015 signing class. Um, comes from the same hometown as Jose Altuve, Miggy Cabrera, and Carlos Guillen. Um, Batted 294. He was a 2017 Dominican Summer League All-Star. Um, showing signs of power. So, a international prospect. If he signed in 2015, that probably means he signed when he was like 16, 17 years old because that's when a lot of those internationals won. So, uh, let's see. Let's see if it gives his date of birth. Uh, yeah, 99. So, he's 21 right now. Um, so, we've got Daniel Montan... Uh, Montano, first Bowman auto for Donnie B. Congrats on that one, Donnie. Oh, and you know what? We didn't even finish that last pack. Hold on. I'm so excited about the auto. Let's finish that last pack. We've got Michael Toglia, Andrew Dahlquist, another Dahlquist paper, Garcia, and Simeon Woods Richardson for that pack. Then we go on to this one, which is Nolan Arenado. Juan Soto. 
We've got Soto. And we have Aaron Judge, Mike Yastrzemski, and we pulled this one earlier tonight, but I'll take another one. And Adley Rutschman for the Orioles. This one's going to Billy B as well. So Billy's starting off hot. And we get the Joe Kelly emoji. Well, don't cry about it. Adley Rutschman. Love it. And um, aren't you glad you didn't trade the Rockies? Yeah, no joke. You were trying to trade those Rockies all night. And then you get the auto first Bowman. Here's a Tyler Soderstrom. Uh, that is a Chrome. That one's going out to the A's. That's also going to Donnie. So Donnie started off hot. Geraldo Perdomo. And then we've got Yun El Choi. I hope I say that right. Um, a lot of the, a lot of the, uh, Asian prospects. I do not know how to say a lot of their names, but I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure it's either Yin Il Choi or Yun Il Choi. Um, but that is a first Bowman as well. That one's going to the Dodgers. That's going to Steel City DW. It's going to Dan. So there we go. The first Bowman Chromes are starting to show up in this box. There's a Soderstrom paper, Marusio, and Bobby Witt in that royal spot for Paco traded into it. Low A, West, playing in Fresno. Tom, how you doing, bud? And here we go. Come on. Yeah. Come on, Bowman Packs. Open for me. You should see the pack, all the wrappers on the bottom. I. It's like I don't even have a trash can down there. Bobachette, Trevor Bauer, Jorge Soler, Jesus Sanchez, and for the Yankees, Jason Dominguez, futurist. Going to Mr. Brian Bosworth. Take what I can get. Well, yeah, it's uh that's that's kind of the fun of breaks, is you know, you never know, you never know what you're gonna get. And I've seen it so many times where teams that people are like, eh, I didn't really want that team, and then a banger shows up. Blake Waltson, and then I've seen other we saw it in the last break where you get the team you want and you know the Austin Martin doesn't show up or something like that. So sometimes it's the team that everyone wants that doesn't show up. Fredius Nova, Geraldo Perdomo, Matt Manning, and Hunter Green. So um, it's always a little bit of a crab shoot, I guess. And you just roll with it in a break. And realize, that to me, the, the more I break and the more I watch people break, the more I do claim that there's a level of entertainment value um, to it as well. It's almost like when you're sitting at a card table in Vegas, Braylon Marquez, where it's not just the money. There's something more to it than that. Shohei Otani, Charlie Blackman, Brian Anderson, Sixto Sanchez. I haven't seen that one yet. The rookie of the year favorite. That one's going to the Marlins. That one's going to John S. AKA Hex. We're going to call you Hex right now. Uh, Braden Shoemake, Nolan Jones, Matthew Libertore and another Jason Dominguez for the Yankees. We didn't see Dominguez at all in that last box. Now we see him twice in this box already. We've only about a quarter of the way through the box. So another Jason Dominguez for Brian Bosworth. And right behind that, we've got Adley Rutschman for the Orioles. And we have Justin Foscu. I haven't even checked if any Astros have been pulled. Um, the Astros, the Astros, you're going to, the Astros are a great spot in the 2020 box. Great spot. Not so great for Bowman, but great in 2020 Bowman, uh, 2020 Top Series 1, because that's where your Jordan Alvarez rookie card um, is. You've got Bryce Harper. Yadier Molina, Frankie Lindor, J.D. Martinez, and Talent Pipeline for the Pirates. Swaggerty, Cruz, Wyman. We have Gunnar Henderson, J.J. Blade for the Marlins. Blade ever going to get called up? Blade Day? I don't follow the Marlins closely enough. Uh, Nick Lofton, Jonathan India, and Bobby Miller. <laughs> the trivia question last night was impossible. It took, I'm surprised, I, I'm surprised it even got guessed. Austin Hayes, uh, Evan White, Leody Tavares. One of these days we'll have to do a, a trivia stream 
Jazz Chisholm rookie. C.J. Abrams, nice one for the Padres here. That's a Bowman Scouts top 100. Um, that one is, who's got the Padres? This one going to Jeremy. We've got Brett Beatty and Pete Crow Armstrong. So a couple of Met, uh, a couple of Mets, Chromes. Those are going to Billy, um, Billy B. And then we've got Miguel Amaya. Robert Plosson for the A's and Taylor Trammell. Robert Plosson, not a bad one. We've got a Casey Mize rookie, a Davey Garcia, a Jake Cronenworth. Crony. Again for the Padres. This box, a little more consistent than maybe the last box so far. We've got Luis Campusano, Ronald Acuna Jr. And we're going to have an Aqua Shimmer. That's going to be the 125 coming up. We've got Nick Allen, Shane Baz, Shea Langoliers, Jackson Rutledge, and our Shimmer going to be for the Mariners. It must be Julio Rodriguez night here at One Cent Sports Cards. That, dude. Okay, so you get the Aqua. So we got the Ace of Lacey blue to 150 in the last break, which is the exact color you want. Um, that because you've got the Royals blue on the, you've got Royals blue on the blue parallel. But to get the Julio Rodriguez Aqua Shimmer parallel for the Mariners, much harder to get a color match, jersey match, color parallel for the Mariners than it is for the Royals. That is a Julio Rodriguez color matched. This is numbered 14 out of 125. That is a beautiful one going out to old style 82. Nice one there. Um, great looking card. Is Shalani still in the house? Um, that is a nice one. That is a beautiful. Plus, it's the Aqua Shimmer. Brand new parallel for 2021 that they introduced. That color. Um, maybe till it would match the Mariners. And there's the Julio Rodriguez. Congrats on that one, old style. Beautiful card there. And in the last box, we got the Julio Rodriguez Atomic Refractor. So we're working on the Julio Rodriguez Parallel Rainbow. We've got Bieber, Yelich, Murphy, Kyle Lewis, and a Casey Mize rookie card, 91 throwback for the Tigers going out to Chris D. Yeah, that is a... That's a nice, that, that's a beautiful looking card. So we've got Casey Mize, 91. Um, we've got Trevor Larnick, Nick Lidolololololololo, Seth Beer, Forrest Whitley, Byron Laura Paper, and Reed Detmers. I wonder if the Angels are going to call Detmers up. They could use the pitching help. My Lord. Um, Angels could use all sorts of help. I think the Angels could use a new manager. I think that's what's going on there. I don't think anyone likes playing for him, um, for Madden. Max Scherzer, Chris Bryant, Santander, Bobby Dahlbeck, rookie, and our Chromes. We've had all the packs in these are weird. Clayton Beater, and there he is for the Twins, Aaron Sabato. For the Twins, going out to Roland. Roland, breaking with us for the first time, gets the Aaron Sabato, first Bowman Chrome. Congrats on that one, Roland. Beautiful one there. And we've got Garrett Mitchell. Another nice one for the Brew Crew. Going to Jeremy. Got all sorts of Jeremy's. That one's, see, we can't just say Jeremy. So for the Brew Crew, that's going to Jeremy R. We've got all sorts of ones in here. Uh, we've got Jeter Downs, Jeremy Pena, and an Austin Martin paper. So we get the Austin Martin Chrome, the Austin Martin paper. So two of them. Mark H. getting this one as well. Paco says, Jordan Otto coming up. I hope so. That would be... Um, 
in all fairness, just the other day, um, we were on the Discord group, and I was showing off all of the Jordan autos I pulled in 2020 for people in breaks. Um, I didn't realize it, but I have pulled quite a few of them. We've got Logan, Logan Gilbert and Bryce Turing to end that pack. So it, I, I pulled, a, I mean, I don't, I, I don't know what a lot is, um, but I know it, I, I know I pulled six or seven of them last year. So, um, I was, I had a hot hand for him. We'll see if it continues. Javier Baez, Whip Merrifield, Joe Adele rookie card, which means Cabrian Hayes is coming up right after that. So Joe Adele going to Jaychez. And Cabrian Hayes right after that. Going to Super. Super, not breaking with us for the first time. Has been breaking with us for a long time. Always good to have you, Super. Um, we've got Jazz Chisel. That is a rookie card. Bowman Scouts Top 100 for the Marlins. And Hex. Um, I'm going, uh, I'm going to A's Angels on the 30th and then Giants Angels on the 31st. Um, so that's not, that's like not, that's in a couple weeks. Uh, Corbin Carroll, there's a Kalanick Chrome. So the Mariner spot for old style pays off big. There's the, uh, Kelnick Chrome, uh, Kelnick Chrome, that too. Kelnick Chrome. That is kind of a tongue twister. We'll take that one. Uh, Gabriel Arias, Bowman first paper, Francisco Alvarez, and Jordan Walker. Next pack. I have opened every pack like that in this for Bowman. That little thing at the edge. Spencer Howard, Cattell Marte, Joey Botto, Keston Hira, Buster Posey, Bryce Jarvis, Maximo Acosta. Uh, this box is pretty nice. Uh, this one's going to the Rangers. This one's going to John. This one's going to Hex. We got to say Hex. And this is a first Bowman Chrome Maximo uh, Casta. So many ways you could say that. So many ways. And right behind that, how about a Pete Crow Armstrong? This one is an atomic refractor parallel Pete Crow a first round dra uh first round 19th overall that's what he was in 2020 so Pete Crow Armstrong atomic refractor parallel going out to Billy Billy congrats on that one and this box I'm officially even though we're not done with it I'm officially saying that this box has been better than that last Bowman box we had O'Neill Cruz Bo Naylor and Brennan Davis so break two which for the last couple times we've had two breaks, uh, break two has maybe not been as good as break one. So break two's breaking the trend tonight, break breaking the, a little bit of a losing streak. Um, we got Garrett Cole, Austin Meadows, Chris Bubik, Tyler Stevenson, and look at that one, nice one, Luis Robert for the White Sox, going to Jay Chez, 1991 Bowman throwback. It's a sweet one right there. Such a bummer. That he went down. Um, he was having a he was having a good season. I think he was batting about three hundred. Maybe not. Didn't have a lot of the running stats that a lot of people expect. But um, you know, the season was still young. It's such a bummer he went down. But keep in mind, still very young. Still plenty of time. Um, injuries do happen. Robert Hassel and Mackenzie Gore, a couple of San Diego Padres Chrome. We've got Zach Veen. Logan Davidson and Tristan Casas. Thank you for that goodie. Be sure to hit that thumbs up. Go over there, take a moment, throw over to first, hit that like button. I agree. Um, all right, we got Anderson Tejada, and you know we're gonna get it. It's just a matter of time. Joey Bart for the Giants going to Jeremy L. So we got the Joey Bart rookie, and we have a Nate Pearson right behind it. We've got Xander Bogarts. And for the White Sox, Andrew Vaughn. 
Nice one there. Positional promise. Going to Jay Chez. And behind that, Blaze Jordan. Come on, come on. Give me a give me a focus. There we go. Blaze Jordan. Nice one there as well. So we get a Blaze Jordan. This one going to the Red Sox. Going to Larry. Nice one. So we have we have Maximo Acosta. Austin Martin, Aaron Sabato, Blaze Jordan, all out of one box. Very nice. And how about a refractor, Nolan Gorman, going to the Cardinals. This one's also going to Larry O. The refractors, this is what I, um, so Bowman draft last year, um, which came out, you know, about six months ago, uh, had a ton of refractors. You would get refractors like one every two packs. The refractors in Bowman Baseball, much harder to pull. This one's a number 297 out of 499. So a nice parallel here for the Cardinals. Just a much harder pull. I think that's like only the third one or fourth one I have pulled out of basically what I would just say like a case. Um, so they're not easy to pull this year. Um, so a nice one there, Nolan Gorman, nice prospect, um, for the Cardinals. That was an Ishmael mania. First, we've got Seth beer and we've got another parallel, a sky blue paper parallel. This one's going to be for the Red Sox and it is Nick York. And this one will be numbered 326 out of 499. Nick York was their first round pick in 2020. Uh, slotted in, he probably should have been a second round pick, but uh, slotted in in the first round. They got him a little bit below the va the, the p positional value for the spot they got him in. I think they got him 21st, uh, 17th overall. Um, they did that so they could save some money for future rounds. So we've got the first rounder for the Red Sox as well that one's going to uh who's got that one that one's going to larry as well so larry having a nice little spot here in bowman whether i got anything or not um all right here we go paul goldschmidt josh bell mookie alex bregman sam huff that is a rookie card for the rangers and we have Jordan Adams, Isaiah Green, Asa Lacey, Alec Thomas, and Wonder, the wonderful Wonder Franco. For the Rays, going to Tom L. So, Tom, congrats on that one. And <clears throat> let me see here. In our next pack, we will have Jose Abreu, Fernando Tatis Jr. Ash, what a comeback he had off the IL. He goes, COVID nothing. Here's a four for four night. COVID nothing. <laughs> All right, Anthony Rendon, Ryan Mountcastle rookie. Nice one. And... Our next one is another nice one for the Tigers and Chris D. Spencer Torkelson. First round pick. The Torque. So a future is Spencer Torkelson. That one's going to Chris D. In our card garden, Bowman showing up in a big way here in break number two. Dylan Dingler, Jason Rosario, Colton Welker. Mick Abel, another nice first Bowman. So the first Bowman's coming out of this box. Real nice. This one's going to the Phillies. This one's going to Jeremy L. My top loaders are giving me all sorts of hassles tonight. They don't want to come out of the box. They're like, no. <laughs> so here we go. Mick Abel, another sweet one. Another first Bowman Chrome. We've got Nick Matten as well. We've got a Nick Bits, a Bitsko and Casey Martin. So Bowman says, oh, you want to say Top Series 1 2020 was better than me in break one, huh? 2020's got its work cut out for him. There's a Kirilov rookie, Jose Garcia, Andreas Jimenez, Dylan Carlson rookie card. 
for the Cardinals. And Larry O. So Larry pulls down a Dylan Carlson rookie as well. And then, if you're going to get one, Spencer, why not get two? Spencer Torkelson, 1991 throwback for the Tigers, going to Chris D. Um, how about them? Dry? Yeah, the 19 spot goodie. I mean, Brandon Crawford, they, he had six RBIs or something, didn't he? Um, so now we've got two Spencer Torkelsons. Um, we've got Drew Waters, James Beard, Blake Waltson, Austin Wells, and Elliot Ramos. Finally saying Larry. <laughs> It only takes time. It just takes time. Uh, Miggy Cabrera, Max Kepler, Glaber Torres. You get a hit. You get a hit. I love it. Blake Snell, Wander, uh, Wander Javier. This for the Twins. Royce Lewis, former first round pick overall. Royce Lewis back in 2017. And Nick Good, uh, uh, Gordon. That is for the Twins. That is their ta talent pipeline card going out to Roland. We've got Jordan Westberg, Gabriel Arias, first Bowman Chrome for the Indians going to Jeremy L. If we can get it in the sleeve. So another first Bowman Chrome coming out. This is much more like the Bowman I've grown to love in 2021. That last box only had four. I've never seen one have that few. I think that's the fewest I've ever pulled out of a box. Fradius Nova, Nick Gonzalez, and Carson Tucker. Um, but we're making up for it in break number two, and I'm sure the people in break number two don't mind. We've got Yu Darvish, Tariq Skubal, Skubal, Clark Schmidt, Tristan McKenzie, a Brady Singer, rookie card, top 100 for the Royals. Singer already pitching in the bigs and another big hitting prospect out there for the Rockies. Zach Veen Chrome. Nice one here for Donnie. So Donnie making hay with that Rocky spot. Jordan Groshans, Drew Waters, Emerson Hancock, and Cade Cavalli. Yeah, the refractor ones look real nice. Um, 91 baseball Bowman. And yeah, so Bowman every year does like the 30 years ago Bowman is kind of a reprint. Reprint. And so this year is 91. I can't wait for 92. That 92 Bowman, my favorite set. Nick Madrigal, Garrett Crochet, Jose Altuve. Oh boy. And that is an orange. That's going to be to 25. But before we do that, we're going to do an Ace of Lacey. So we're going to get an orange hobby box only coming up. Could be, could be a monster. Let's see what it is. I believe it's going to be a Bowman Scouts top 100. So there's an Ace of Lacey Chrome. That one's going to Paco. Nice one there. We've got Ryan Valade, Josh Jung, Christopher Morel first, Antonio Gomez first. And Jose Altuve is going to be our reveal card. Bowman Scouts top 100. Going to be the Mariners. And it's going to be Taylor Trammell, 57 overall. And this card is going to be numbered 14 out of 25. So this one also going to old style 82. And it is a... Orange parallel numbered. Let me get this on here. Let me see if I can get it right. 14 up here. 14 out of 25. Beautiful. Beautiful. So, yeah. So this card took me off my 92 Bowman. 92 Bowman. Um. I don't, let me see. Let me see if they're close. I'll, I'll show you guys something. Some of you guys have probably seen this, but if some of you newer people haven't, I like 92 Bowman so much that I, uh, I made my promotional baseball card, the 92 Bowman design. So one cent sports cards does have its own 
baseball card. It looks like that. And it is out of the 92 Bowman design. It is my favorite card design of all time. And what was awesome is they did um, Bowman Heritage last year. They did it in that design, which was awesome. Um, and those boxes, the Bowman Heritage 2020 boxes, those boxes are fire. If you have not ever seen any boxes being opened on that, go back, go check out. We opened a few boxes on this channel. Just amazing, amazing boxes. Um, and they're all in the 92 design. The Joe Adele. I think I have the Joe Adele, the yellow. It is, it's awesome. Uh, so we're probably going to see that next year in this set. Machado Garcia rookie. Sixto Sanchez rookie. Andres Jimenez, rated uh, Rookie of the Year favorites. This one's going to the Mets. Billy B. Uh, Jimenez got sent down. He's actually on the Indians. They sent him down. He needed to be sent down. Um, I still think he's going to be a good prospect, but was just not hitting. And for the Halos, first Bowman Chrome, Alexander Ramirez. Going to Jay Chez. Nice one there. First Bowman Chrome. We've got Royce Lewis. We've got Logan Davidson, Jordan Westberg, Grayson Rodriguez, and Alec Manoa. And we are down to our last pack of Bowman. See if we can get some mojo. See if we can get one more out of here. We've got enough Mariners. We pulled most of the big prospect cards. So let's see if Bowman has one last surprise for us. We're going to start with Jordan Alvarez. Jacob deGrom, Clevenger, Matt Chapman, Riley Green, Futurist. Future is now. Riley Green, that's going to be for the Tigers. We've got Edward Cabrera and Mario Feliciano, Marco Luciano, Tyler Callahan, and Josiah Gray to end the Bowman portion of, the, of break number two. Now, this box, without a doubt, I mean, it is, it left no doubt. This box is going to be a tough one for 2020 to 2020 top series one to keep up with. But, hold faith. But we'll go over the hits here real quick. Old style came out pretty nice, but we, uh, we hit a lot, a lot, a lot of first Bowman Chromes in this one. So we'll take those. We've got uh, a few parallels and whatnot. So let's see what we end up with here. We kind of went all in. So let's see what we had here. First, we had a few of the, you know, a few more Chromes over here. The Ace of Lacey Chrome. Dylan Carlson, rookie, Wander Franco, the Andrew Vaughn, positional promise, Kalanick Chrome, uh, the Cabrian Hayes, Joe Adele, rookies, Casey Mize, 91, Cronenworth, Jason Dominguez, Bohm, rookie, the Julio Rodriguez, Chrome. Um, and then we had the Kevin Alcantara, paper, the Adley Rutschman, top 100, Jason Dominguez, futurist, Luis Robert, 91, that's a sweet one, Spencer Torkelson, 91, Spencer Torkelson, futurist, Austin Martin paper. Our auto was the Daniel Montan uh, Montano first Bowman Chrome. We had the Aaron Sabato first Bowman Chrome. Maximo Acosta first Bowman Chrome. Yin Il Choi first Bowman Chrome. Austin Martin first Bowman Chrome. Eddie Diaz first Bowman Chrome. Mick Abel first Bowman Chrome. Blaze Jordan first Bowman Chrome. What a box. Nolan Gorman refractor 297 out of 499. The Nick York. Sky Blue Paper Parallel 326 out of 499. Pete Crow Armstrong Atomic Refractor Parallel. The Julio Rodriguez Aqua Shimmer. That is a brilliant looking card right there. Numbered 14 out of 125. And a Taylor Trammell Bowman Scouts Top 100 Orange Parallel. Numbered 14 out of 25. Just a killer, killer box. Um, that's what... That's uh, the sad part is, is that's like what the expectation is for Bowman and their unrealistic expectations. However, um, we'll take it all day. Just a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful box. Um, 
and we still have half of the break to go. So I'm putting together the 2020 archives, 55 Bowman set. If anyone has doubles, 50, um, 2020 archives, 55 Bowman set. Um, goody. If you put a list over on discord of the numbers you need, I believe I have my 2020 archives numerically ordered. I don't know why I do, but I think I have them numerically ordered. So I might be able to help you there. I can check it out for you. Um, all right. So now tops series one has some serious competition in Bowman that we know of, but tops one in break one. So we're going to have a tie. We're going to have to do a, We'll see. We'll see. Got us. If we pull a lot of the big rookies out of here, all it takes is one card to change the fortunes or one silver parallel card, because don't forget we get a silver parallel pack. So here we go. We'll pull these out. And We'll put the silver parallel here at the bottom. Let's see there. Uh, there go. All right. So here we go. First pack, series one, 2020. Hunter Alberto, Conforto, Rizzo. Trey Turner, Quintana, Paxton, Dylan Cease, rookie, Rendon, Andrew Chaffin, Soler, Rendon again, and right off the bat, future stars, Chris Paddock for the Padres. This one going to Jeremy R. It is a black border parallel. That's a sick looking card right there. Um, black border parallel, I believe this should be numbered to 67, 69, 45 out of 69. First pack top series one, 2020 says, hold my beer. We'll start with the Chris Paddock future star. Nice one. Beautiful one there um, for the Padres. And Jeremy R. So here we go. Jeff McNeil, future star, JT Riddle. In 2020 tops, a Nolan Ryan relic with Astros is coming. Nolan Ryan relic. Call him the Nolan Ryan relic. You also called the auto. So we'll see. Um, here we go. Nick Paveda, Dietrich, Matt Stram, Nolan Arenado, Omar Navarez, Reese McGuire. Matt Theis, rookie card. Daniel Vogelbach, Strasburg. Mitch Hanniger, Juan Soto, World Series. Soto time. Chris Paddock to 69. Now, if you, knew, if you know the print runs from 2020, this, those are hard to get. Um, all right, we've got Wade Boggs. I believe the black borders are hobby only as well. Um, I could be wrong on that, but if I remember, we've got a Wade Boggs 85 right there. Cool one for the Red Sox going out to Larry. Um, we've got Shane Bieber and Austin Nola rookie card. Looking for the rookies. All right, here we go. Savale, nice rookie right there. I'm telling you, the Indians pitchers. I, I, the Indians just produce pitchers, man. Um, Justin Verlander, Aristides Aquino for the Reds. That one is going old style's way. Jeremy with the Soto emoji. Love it. Aquino. And we've got Luis Garcia. Ryu. Clevenger. Hamilton. Flip them around. Tim Anderson, Jose Abreu, Glaver, Garrett Cole, and a very nice rainbow foil parallel for the Astros. Carlos 
Correa going to Paco. So a Carlos Correa rainbow foil. We'll take that one. Correa is in its contract season, I believe. Correa's cards. I put a video out earlier this year saying, watch Correa. Um, I get he's on the Astros. He's going to get, there's no way he's re signed him with the Astros. Um, you've got Jesse Winker, and you've also got the Pete Alonzo Tops All Star Rookie Cup for the Mets going to Billy B. Chachi, how you doing? Good to see you. Just doing some 2020 Series 1. Austin Riley, Richards, whoop, Kenta Maeda, Yastrzemski, Robles, Garcia, Nicky Lopez, Smith, Scherzer, Emilio Pagan, Verlander, Andy Pettit, 2000 Decades Best, a Kyle Schwarber, Schwarber, and a Hector Neris. So not much doing in that pack. Still looking. The rookies, the, some of the rookies have evaded us in 2020 so far. Radone, Hunter Renfro, Kyle Hendricks, Polanco, Sean Doolittle, Brandon Belt, Pete Alonzo League leader, Merrill Ker Kelly, Brock Holt, Trevor Bauer, CJ Crone, Aaron Nola, Andrew Benintendi, and Cesar Hernandez. So, Chachi, were you on uh, BITG tonight? Wasn't he opening a few Bowman? What, what did he get out of Bowman? I know he was doing some Bowman tonight. Uh, Devers, Real Muto, Grinky, Taylor Rogers, Ken Giles, Tyler Glass now. You sick Gucci all the time. Adamas, Cubs, Tim and Yolmer, Strasburg, and Mookie Betts on the Red Sox. It's like so weird that just a year ago, Mookie Betts was still on. It seems like he's been on the Dodgers forever already, doesn't it? Um, Mookie Betts, 1985, Red Sox. Going to Larry. And we have Anthony Santander and Mike Fires. Next pack up. We've got Bregman, Jeffers, Santana. There he is. Big Jordan Alvarez rookie card. Plus, this, this is an iconic card if you ask me. Plus the Topps All-Star Rookie Cup. And the RC logo in one with just a beautiful Jordan Alvarez sh shot where it looks like he's just hammering one eight bazillion feet. Um, beautiful card there. Going to Paco. Paco, congratulations on that one. We've got Mike Soroka. And Jordan has just been a beast. He's got to stay healthy, though. Adam Frazier. Uh, Tommy Edmond. Josh Fegley, Josh Fugley, uh, Orlando Arcia, Wade Davis, Joey Votto, Stephen Matz, David Peralta, and Michael Pineda. Only in there for a bit. Didn't see crazy night here. Oh, well, I uh, hope, hope everything's okay. Um, yeah, I've had every night at my house seems crazy lately. I think I've bitten off more than I can chew this spring five sports and deck rebuild and electric and Clayton Kershaw, Ramon Laureano, Cole Calhoun. I need a vacation. And guess what? I'm going on one for Memorial day weekend. Uh, I got Blake Parker, Shane green, Jose Martinez, Randall Gerchuk, the New York Mets twins, Marco Gonzalez, Lewis Thorpe rookie, and another Pete Alonzo. This is the, uh, Top's choice. And what design? What design? 63, 65. 1965 design. Pete Alonzo. Another one for Billy B. 
Nice one there. Kind of a precursor to the top 70th anniversary set, if you ask me. But a cool one there. And we've got Javi Baez and Chase Anderson. Paco's loving it. See if we can get you two. Let's pull a parallel. That'd be even cooler. Jesus Luzardo, rookie card for the A's. I'm going to Donnie. And we have the Carlos Correa base this time. Brian Abreu, Miggy Cabrera, Carson Kelly, Yelich, Paul Goldschmidt, Juan Segura, Atlanta Braves, goodbye home run, Roberto Perez, and a Justin Verlander tops now. Card of a card. Um, third career no hitter. So that one's going to Paco as well. We've got Christian Stewart. And Jose Urquidy rookie card for the Astros. My favorite tops year, 1965. Um, I'm embarrassed to say what my favorite year is, but because it's most, it's almost everyone's least favorite. Tyler Alexander. Um, but my favorite tops year. I like a lot of them. Tops has a lot of good designs over the year, but mine, and it has a lot to do with just like I collected a lot then. I was probably more obsessed that year. Daniel Murphy, Bobby Bradley rookie than any other year, uh, but it would be 1990. Um, Kevin Pillar, there's the Kyle Lewis rookie card for the Mariners. Going to old style, old style, cleaning up in that Mariners spot, doing the work. Kyle Lewis. Rookie card. So there's the Lewis. We've got the Alvarez. We've got the Bo Bichette in the last box. Um, see if we can get one here. Bubba Starling. We've got Gavin Lux in the last one too. Freddie Peralta. Logan Allen. Yadier Molina. Houston Astros. Nick Senzel. And George Springer. And Jake Rogers rookie card. 87, the Woodbacks are definitely in the top five. Uh, the 87s are cool. I love the 86 design with the big black border at the top. Um, and But for whatever reason, that 1990s, and most people hate the 90s design. Um, Andrew Haney, because it's just, it, but it screams 90s. Like if you think about the early 90s, it is a great design for that era. Everyone was into those big, bright neon colors. Um and it kind of had a little bit of a hip hop flair to it with just kind of the uh, color schemes that they were using. Um, it was, it was exactly it, when you look at it, you go, yeah, that cards from 1990. That's what was popular then. Frankie Lindor, uh, JD uh, Martinez, Brad Keller, Annabel Sanchez, Gonzalez nationals, Rogelio Armenteros rookie card, Matt Olson, that's not one. Um, and then this is a blue. It's not numbered, but this is a blue, which is limited. Uh, Jacob deGrom for the Mets. So a nice one here. Uh, decades best awards winner for 2010's Jacob deGrom. This is a blue limited, not numbered, but it is a limited like, kind of a short print of a decades best. So a nice one there for the Mets. That one's going out to Billy B. We've got Whit Merrifield and a Sam Hilliard rookie card for the Rockies going out to Donnie as well. Started collecting in 87 and 88. 65 is my favorite because it was my first maze card I got for Christmas in one of those early 90s years. Um, yeah, and remember when you collected like in the late 80s and early 90s and they were like, if you had the 52 Mickey Mantle, it's it's $25,000 right now. And everyone's like, who would spend that much on a card? Gosh, if you spent that much on a card back then, <laughs> Luke Jackson, Mike Talkman, And that was before you had, well, you had PSA, but they were tiny. Uh, David Price, Melky Cabrera, no one cared about. They just said, you go to your card shop, you trade your cards. It was a, it was a simpler time. Posey, Jack Flaherty, Dominic Smith, Josh Van Meter. Lester, uh, Edgar Martinez, Decades Best. That one's going to the Mariners as well. So Old School gets another sweet little Edgar Martinez card. And we have Enrique Hernandez and Michael Ch Chavis. Ch Chavis. 
Do the Bart Man. <laughs> um, I remember being beside myself Christmas of 88 when I got the complete 1987 top set as a present. From then on, I stopped buying packs. Nothing but the whole boxes from 12 years old on. Gary Sanchez. Here's a crazy one for me. Bowman, 1992. Um, I remember being at a on a Costco run. There's a Ronald Acuna Jr. with my grandpa. My gra- Costco was brand new, so you know everyone's like, "Gotta go to Costco and buy 80 bazillion rolls of toilet paper." And it's not a pandemic. Um, let's see, we've got Garver and. At the time, because baseball cards were so popular, you could actually get baseball cards at um, Costco. There's a Randy Arosa Reina. This one's going out to the Cardinals. Going to Larry O, the Arosa Reina rookie card. Um, Very nice one here for Larry. Congrats on that one. And so I'm with my grandpa, and they had one pallet. It was a full pallet of... Um, Bowman 1992, and that was before Bowman really took off because it was more limited in print run. Ian Desmond, Luis Castillo, Yolmer Sanchez, there's a Zach Collins rookie. And um, my I talked my grandpa into buying one. He bought the box. I remember it was 25 bucks back then, which was a lot of money for a box of baseball cards, at least in my grandpa's eyes. Um, close call, and... A week later, I was at my grandpa's house and I said, we got to go back there and get another one. And he was like, if you clean the tiles on my pool, I will take you. So this card right here, we got to figure out who this card is going to. And I got my second box that night. So this one is either going to Minnesota or Detroit. So that this is going to the Twins or the Tigers. Here's how we're going to figure this one out. It is a close call gold parallel numbered 671 to 2020. So we're going to say... The Twins are one, two, three. The Tigers are four, five, six on a dice roll. So it is a four. This one's going to the Tigers. So this one's going to Chris Day. Here's the four, by the way, in case you didn't see it. So that one goes to Chris Day. The close call, um, gold parallel. And then we get Mike Trout, ding, number five on the night, or maybe six even. Um, So a nice Mike Trout. And then we've got Nelson Cruz. So he bought me my second box of Bowman 92. I think I completed the set. And if you remember those packs, they all had the gold foil parallels in them. Um, And my favorite card was the Manny Ramirez. Um, And I had that Manny Ramirez for years and years and years. Um, And it was... uh, when that set really went up in value, Ahmed Rosario, Andrew Kashner, DeGrom, I thought I was like, I, it was basically the closest set to 89 upper deck that didn't say 89 upper deck in value. And some of those gold foil cards were worth hundreds of dollars back then. Tyler Thornton, to, uh, or Trent Thornton, Max Muncy. And so, I mean, I walked around the neighborhood like I was the biggest, like I... I, like I own the neighborhood. Uh, here's a nice Duke Snyder, 1950 for the Dodgers. And as it turned out, a lot of those cards ended up not being worth that much because they finally figured out, oh yeah, they weren't that rare. But some of those cards, like the Mariano Rivera, 92 Bowman, big one, big card, Yoan Moncada. Um, no, I thought, for some reason, I thought that was a short print. Um, Framil Reyes. So anyways, that's my story. That's why 92 Bowman is like one of my favorite sets. Um, Because it's just, it reminds me of family. It does. It reminds me of of being a child. I was like 13, 14 at the time. David Bodie, uh, Chris Archer, Peraza, Herbie Yates, Andreas Munoz, Scherzer, Guriel. There's the like father, like son. Cool card here with Bo Bichette and Kevin Biggio. Going to the Blue Jays, going to Mark H. We've got Kevin Biggio, future star, right after it. Yasmani Grandal and the Hollywood Heroes for the Dodgers. Bellinger and who's the other one? Who's that on the back? Uh, it's Bellinger. Is that, is that Jock Peterson? 27? Isn't that Jock Peterson? Let's see. It'll tell us. Verdugo, 
Well, Verdugo's not on the team. That's why I was like, wait, who is that? But that is a rainbow foil parallel for the Dodgers. And Steel City DW. We've got David Dahl and Albert Alzale rookie card as well. Uh, what vintage baseball cards I have are maybe a buck a card. Well, vintage is just, is because maybe even more popular right now than ultra modern. Um, low pop, high PSA vintage cards of people that you probably haven't even heard of. There is a market for those right now that is unreal. I mean, and when I say unreal, it is, it is unreal. Um, Michael Brousseau rookie card. They got to be low pop though. Tyler White, Danny Holson. Um, and so if you've got one that's got like maybe just a couple dozen like PSA 9s, Chance Cisco, there's a nice Nick Solak rookie card for the Rangers. That one's going to John. That one's going to Hex. And then we have Jay Bruce. Tyler Naquin, Giolito. There's the Zach Gallen rookie card that we've been looking for for the Diamondbacks. That one's going to Iris. Zach Gallen time. So the rookie's starting to show up here, kind of three quarters of the way through the box. Um, we've got Wagyu Speck, Aaron Judge, 85 design. For the Yankees and Brian Bosworth. And we have Yuli Guriel and Michael Baez rookie card. I have a storage room. Over there. <laughs> still have still have the Manny, not gold though. Yeah, the gold was the one that well, and the sad part is is I lost a lot of my childhood cards in a hasty move out of my parents' house. That is that is the politically correct way to say I was one of those kids who said, I don't need to live here anymore. And I left all my stuff behind. I literally just left. Um, Dustin May. And then I realized the error of my ways a little later in life. Um, because you do realize at some point you need your parents. There's a Nico Horner. So here come the rookies. Dustin May showed up. Here comes Nico Horner. Uh, but yeah, it, we... So I think my, my stepmom, it's that classic story of, she said, fine, I'm cleaning out your room. And although she didn't throw out like the binders and stuff I had, uh, she didn't throw out the bulk cards. So a lot of those cards that probably would have a lot of the cards that I didn't see as valuable back in the day. Cause I was like, oh, I love Mark McGuire. Um, you know, they, they may or may not have had. Plenty of awesome rookies back in there. But hey, what are you going to do? Austin Barnes. Here's a home run challenge. George Springer. You can always try and see if it works. Probably won't. Roberto Osuna and Josh Rojas. With the Pop 94. The T206 cards are... God, uh, yeah. I mean, anytime you get one of those. Mercado. Cooper. Um... Really cool cards to have. Liam Hendricks soaking it all in. One Soto. We've hit a lot of we've hit a lot of Soto base. Would love to hit a Soto parallel, but we've hit a lot of Soto base tonight. I'll take that. Kevin McCarthy and Amir Garrett, Eduardo Rodriguez, Ryan Presley, and a nice Ernie Banks for the Cubbies coming out. Steel City DW. And we have Tommy LaStella and Sean Murphy rookie card. All I got is three Clemente early 70s batting leaders. Rose Clemente and 71 Mays. Uh, Oliva, Cepeda, and Gamble rookie. It's absurd. That's about as vintage as I got. Well, those are nice vintage ones to have. Uh, Roman Quinn. And we're going to have... Something coming up here. Alec Colomb, Joey Lueschi. Started talking about nostalgia here a little bit and forgot that we had not had our hit yet in this box. Brandon Drury, Eloy Jimenez, All-Star Rookie Cup. There's the Soto. We've seen the Soto logo a lot. Jeremy Little all over it. Isan Diaz, Rookie Card. 
Charlie Kluberson, Jackie Bradley Jr., Ian Kennedy, and we have... Oh, that is a nice one. How about a Roger Clemens Black Border Relic? Um, hold on, I got to get some scissors for this one. I'll put it up here in just a second. I want to get it sleeved. Um, Black Border Jersey Relic Red Sox going to Larry O. Numbered 140 out of 199. You got to be careful with these, the black borders. That's a clean one, too. Nice and centered. Beautiful one here. Larry comes home with the hit. So Larry pulls down a Roger Clemens game used jersey relic. Black border numbered to 199. A very nice one there. That's a nice looking card with that black border and the Red Sox. That's a beautiful card. I like it. That's a clean card. All right, I'm going to pull some of these out of the way too, just so we can. Lots and lots of cards. We have gone through about 1,300 cards tonight. All right, now let's finish this pack out with Brian Anderson and Mike Moustakis. I did get a Topps Finest Refractor of Maze and one of Mantle. Was that, um, well, that wouldn't have been, was that from last year or the Topps Finest from 92? Or is that from like a different year? Um, all right, here we go. Candelario, Brendan McKay rookie, Marisnik, Sandoval rookie, Chapman, Smith, Jeff Smarja. Mauricio Dubon, rookie, Kepler, Italian, Andrew Miller, Jake Rogers, 85, rookie, for the Tigers, going to Chris. Yeah, that's a sweet-looking relic for sure. You know what's funny? Relics are, like, way more rare than autos these days. Uh, Max Stassi and Adrian Morjan. So a lot of nice little rookies coming out of there. We have... David Fletcher, Anthony K. Rookie, Verdugo, Bryce Harper, Michael Givens, Starling Castro, Jordan Yamamoto, Red Sox, Phillies, Manny being Manny, Daniel Megden, and a Tyler Glass now, Rainbow Foil for the Rays. Going to Tom L. More top loaders going through two top loaders tonight as well. So, can I, do I have, oh, okay, I do have room. I was like, I feel like I should have more room. We'll put Tyler back here. All right, then we've got Daniel Polka and Ian Kinsler to end that pack. We've got three packs to go before we get to our silver pack. The 97s, all right. Um. All right, Senzel, Goodrum, Tony Gonslin, rookie card. We've got Kipnis, Mikolas, Vladimir Guerrero Jr., Tops All-Star Rookie Cup for Mark H. Vladdy, just being a beast. The fact that he's, and it's the one that was good this year, he's, he's, uh, he's good shape. Uh, Tyler Beatty, Zach Wheeler, Yerman Marquez, Jake Lamb, Ben Gamble, and then we have an Ichiro, the Mariners, man. The Mariners have been hitting this whole break. The Ichiro Decades Best Die Cut. Yo. Such a hard card to sleeve, but really cool. So we get the Ichiro Decades Best Die Cut. This one, obviously, as we all know by now, who's got the Mariners? Old school. Very nice one there. We've got Matt Barnes and Jake Arietta. Silver pack, you're my only hope. Jeremy L. Hanging on by a thread. You never know. You never know. Like, for example, pretty late in the break, but if you're patient, you get 
a Boba Shet rookie. Mark H gets the Boba Shet late. So the tops box quietly. I know we've been talking about nostalgia and stuff like that, and kind of going off on a little bit of a tangent. Um, but slowly but surely, don't look now, but wait until you see some of the rookies we have in here. Sonny Gray, Fernando Tatis Jr. tops All Star rookie cup. I think the only one, the only big one we haven't pulled is Lux. I think and we still have a chance at doing it. There's the Fernando Tatis Jr. That one's going out to the Padres. That one's going to Jeremy R. We've got Tim Anderson, Cattell Marte, Chris Paddock, Jorge Polanco, Domingo Santana, Starling Marte, Brandon Crawford, Austin Meadows, New York Yankees team card, Christian Vasquez, and Blake Trainin. And we're down to the last pack before the silver pack. Let's see what we can get. Now, remember, the silver packs can have autos as well. They're not guaranteed, but they can. Um, all right, here we go. Manny Machado, Dwight Smith, Chapman, Flowers, Evan Longoria, Jordan Zimmerman, Abraham Toro, rookie, Cardinals, Close Call, Scott Kingry, Mashihiro Tanaka, and speaking of vintage, how about a little Sandy Koufax 85 throwback? Nice one there for the Dodgers. Steel City. Steel City got a lot of those in this uh, box. Nick Markakis and Luke Voigt. So now we go to the ever-coveted Silver Pack, which is blue, by the way. Um, I like to call them Silver Pack. Mojos. Let's see what we can get out of here. Um, well, we are not going to get a, we're not, there's this guy. We're not going to get a parallel, but what we are going to get is a Mookie Betts for the Red Sox. Larry gets another Mookie Betts. So I think that's the second one because we got the base. Now we have the Mojo Refractor. So we'll take that one for the Angels. And Jay Chaz, we have a Matt Dice rookie card. Rookie card mojo style. For the Brew Crew and Jeremy R, I have a Keston Hira. Poor Keston just been a, was a mess last year and so far this year. Sent him down. Hopefully he can get it together. Uh, Keston had a great 2019, so if he can put it back together, it'll be great. And our last card of the night, going to the Rockies and Donnie B. It is a Nolan Arenado Mojo Refractor, and that will be the end of break two. So the question is, was the top box better than the Bowman, or was the Bowman better box better than the Tops box? Here's what... I, uh, and I think it's closer. That Bowman box was real nice. I think the Bowman one is going to cut cut uh, the fact that we got the 1 to 125, um, the Julio Rodriguez to 125, and the Taylor Trammell to 25, I think is what edges it out. However, this box, not shabby at all. Um, in fact, you'll see here in a minute why I'm saying that. Because... We ended up with quite a few of the 2020 rookies we were looking for. So, for example, well, we just went over all these. We just saw those. So we got the Tati second year, the Ichiro die cut, the Vladimir second year, Nico Horner rookie, Dustin May rookie, Pete Alonzo in the 65 design, Mookie Betts 85, Aquino rookie, Jordan Alvarez rookie, that's a big one. Nick Solak, rookie. Kyle Lewis, rookie. Randy Arozarena, rookie. Zach Gallen, rookie. Bo Bichette, rookie. A nice, I mean, that's nice. Uh, Tyler Glass now, rainbow foil. The relic hit of the box was a 140 out of 199 black border parallel Roger Clemens. Uh, we also had the black um, Chris Paddock future star parallel numbered 45 out of 69. We had the close call. This one's going to the Tigers. 
This one is uh, numbered 671 out of 2020. The Hollywood Heroes Dodgers card. That is a rainbow foil. The Carlos Correa rainbow foil. And the Jacob deGrom Blue Decades Best 2010 Awards winners. So, I don't know, man. That's like pretty close because two pretty low numbered parallels. I think we'll edge it out. Give it to the Bowman box and break two. And we will let the debate rage on. However, two very, very nice sets. Um, the Bowman 2021 set, great set. The 2020 Series 1 is a very nice set as well. I believe 20. I, I said it last year when it came out. That 2020 Series 1 set is one of those sets here in a few years that I think is just going to go up and up in value. There are so many good rookies in there with Bo Bichette, um, Jordan Alvarez, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. leading the way in that set, plus Gavin Lux. You've got a few other ones in there like Trent Grisham, Randy Rosarena. Just a just a loaded set. So um, kind of one of those sets that's still kind of affordable, but it's been slowly going up. So keep an eye on it because um, it's one of those sets that if you're thinking, hey, I kind of like that set, might want to hold on to a box or two for a couple years, see what happens. Um, now's the time to buy them. So. It is early morning here. So um, I want to thank everyone that got into the break and I in break one and in break two. I know it's pretty late. Let's see, it's 1222. Um, I will leave you all with the one emoji I didn't use out of respect for my Astros, the trash can emoji. Jeremy, thank you very much again for um, hanging out and thank you very much for becoming a YouTube member. And um, I really appreciate you using all the emojis and showing them off. Um, I think we might actually be able to add another one. So if I can, I'm going to let you choose what it is. <laughs> so, so, um, and congratulations on the Astros taking over first place today. So I'm sure a few more series with the Angels and they will pad their lead a little bit. Um, that's how I feel about my Angels right now. So, um, Tom, you are welcome. Thank you very, very much for hanging out as well. And we will... Um, Get all these cards shipped out sometime or hopefully by early to mid next week. Um, so these will go out. Your other packages went out today if you were in last week's break. Next week, I am on vacation. I am going away to the hills of southern Ohio. Um, so I don't think I'm going to be doing a break next week, but I might do one early the following week. Uh, we got some sets coming out. But I do need a vacation. I am burnt out. Um, not on cards. I'm burnt out on like everything else in life. So I'm going to be going away for the Memorial Day weekend. So I will not see uh, you guys on a live stream unless I do one early next week. I don't think that's going to happen. I'm going to try and get a, depending on if Checklist comes out, a Top's Finest um, set review out. If it comes out, if that Checklist comes out early enough, Um I'm actually bringing my computer down to where I'm going to work on it because I think it's going to come out late next week. So anyways, be on the lookout for that. Um, I think once that set comes out, and there's a few other sets coming out later in May, um, I'm planning on doing an auction um, maybe later this month that would be a Patreon-only auction. I haven't done one of those in a while. Um, so we'll see about that. I'm going to try and get one more break in um, before the end of the month as well. But if I, but if I don't stream before Memorial Day, I hope you guys all, I, I think I will, but, um, if I don't, I hope you guys all have a fantastic Memorial Day. Enjoy some time off with family and friends and whatnot. So, um, yeah, uh, old style you kind of cleaned up on that break. Congratulations. So with that guys, uh, I think I am going to sign off and I hope you all have a good evening, a good weekend. Hopefully we can get together one more time, uh, maybe early next week. We'll see. But um, with that, I am going to sign off. And as always, hope you guys are having good luck on your personal pack polls. I hope you are being good to your family, being good to your friends, and being good to your neighbors. And until next time, take care.